let's say you do a record with Lloyd Banks. Ain't gonna be no 50 posts later, like. Look at these niggas. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I mean, that nigga plays chess. I have no fucking idea. Yeah, right? I, I like Banks. I like. As a matter of fact, I, I I took cheap shots at Banks on some battle rap shit because I wanted to battle rap with the nigga to smack. So, to the camera like, round. To the camera round. You heard it here yeah. first. Oh, uh-huh. Graph versus Lloyd Good. Banks. Going down <laughs> next year. State tour. 2020. Starting here. <laughs> Mike's for the pin. Bro. <laughs> Door off, take the hinges with the door panel in the wall off. Bodies getting hauled off, lips getting torn off. Leg him with the sword off. He looking like a walking dead zombie trying to crawl off. All right, we back. My expert opinion, episode 17. Mm. More point, nigga. Yeah. Mm. More point, nigga. You heard got it. As usual, I got the king in the Woo. building. It's for you already. You know what I'm saying? My man Bang over there. Shout out my man D. You know what I'm saying? Knowledge. Yes, born. sir. What's you the already know. We here, man. Mm-hmm. Hip hop is real. And I got one of the. Bro. When it comes to like lyricism, mm. when it comes to like intricacy, when it comes to mm. flow, graph. Bo- like, Bo- there's Bo- a Bo- lot of lists. And I, I don't be seeing your name, and I'm like, how, my nigga? Mm. What, what is it? Like, you man been you're, you're MC, so you know. Exactly. Plus, you name dropped me in a freestyle. That was, that was cool. <laughs> <laughs> that was cool. Thanks. Well, um, Thanks. to continue, we're going we gonna to jump into something. Matter of fact, before we do that, how's everybody week? Uh, me, I was good. I went to an event out in Orlando, you know, uh, the you know, rematch of Chilla. You know what I'm Chilla saying? Versus DNA. DNA. You know I heard what I'm that saying? Was a snooze fest. Wasn't the best one. It was uh <laughs> yeah. yeah. Twerk and Sway Sever. That was that was, that was good. Night, yeah. right? Geechee and Don Marino. Mm. Mike P, Dre Dennis. Those mm. was a couple of standouts. Who, who would you say got those? Uh Geechee beat Don Marino. Uh-huh. Clear. Yeah, I mean it he just he just actually, you know, I think he took it from that A Ward shit where like, yo, it's not on you, I really don't count. Nah, he, he took it he like said, he said, they gonna nah, watch that shit. Not no, they, I'm not I'm not, not playing around. Twice. So he took Don serious, so he just right. was like a little better. Right. You know what I'm saying? And Geechee's a little more relatable to the shit that I like. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Don Marino hit you with the Mexican bars and all that. Dre Dennis, Mike P. Dre Dennis, he beat Mike P, man. I don't even think Mike P I think Mike P knew that he yo, Mike P, man. You ain't giving <laughs> yeah. my recap, my nigga. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I wanted my he, recap, my nigga. He bounced. Yeah, he left, He's man. He left. He... Yeah. Oh, losers, I mean, losers don't stick around. everybody, you know what it is? Dre Dennis was like, yo, if you I did that a if you on URL <laughs> and you one of them top <laughs> niggas and you got that spot, you get all the summer madnesses, yeah. I'm going to clearly show that I'm better than you tonight. So right. them niggas could be like, at least, like, I can't shit on me. Like, right. you know what I'm saying? I think that he came with that type of energy. But yeah, man. I think, I think that happens a lot. Like, if the guys that's like really hungry when they get that shot, like, sometimes you'd be like, eh. Was it a good Mike P, though? It was a good Mike P. I think that's why he might have been a little upset. But that's just my opinion. Mike P going to have to say how he felt. Right. But for me, I feel like since he did a good job and Dre was just better, it was like, damn, I came to beat this nigga. He came out here and went crazy on me. Wow. And he ain't used no race jokes? Uh, he, he had a light. Nah, he was yeah. really talking to Mike P. That's what's up. Yeah, it wasn't Somebody even like on some... and was saying, um, did, did Mike P call him uh, the N-word? Who? Somebody posted Dre that. Dennis? Yeah. See that? Yeah. I mean, I didn't hear it. I think yeah, it would have yeah, got reaction. I, I think it would have got a lot of reaction. No, I think it got some reaction. That would have made, yeah. made the news. I saw a clip. That made the news. I don't know. I got to listen to it. It might have yeah, sounded. I don't know. I don't know. But I don't I, know. In the building, I didn't, I didn't hear nothing. I can't, I can't uh, see Mike P thinking, Yo, I'm going yeah. to go to Florida. Well, me neither. I'm going to drop the end bomb. No, me neither. Yeah, I can't see that. I didn't. Oh, um, like, great way to go viral. But it was a good weekend. Shout out to uh, G, uh, Guardians of the Culture. Bear Guardians arms. of the Culture. Shout out to y'all. Word, word. For y'all ain't getting to bring Matt Hoff. I'm surprised, man. That's I'm a good call. Um, <laughs> it's cool. We'll, we'll work on it. Um, Sway versus Twerk. Mm. Dope. Twerk said he wrote all three rounds in a day. If he did, he's the best nigga in battle rap. In a day? Three rounds yeah. like that? No choking? Yeah. And you know what? He might have. I'm just saying, if he, he did write have. those three rounds in a day, who I, like, I wrote how in, can you do that? I wrote in seconds. But I don't mean thirds. memorize them in a day, but you know. He said he wrote them yeah. in battle rap like, a he's, couple times. He said I, I had ran 12 in another bars. country. And I see Charlie Clips, I'll be like, yo, how much you got? 
And he said and he'd nothing. be like, yo, I got one round. That's crazy. I got, like, I got one and a half, nigga. <laughs> we in the parking lot <laughs> all night and during the day. Then we head to the venue and we cook. And we'd be like, oh, shit, mm -hmm. we did it. We the greatest. That's crazy. But it's not cool to do that. Right. But that's real talent though. Like as a writer, that's like when you can right. really come up with shit and keep coming up with shit and memorize that right, shit right away. And right. Don't know how hard that is. And Get crowd reaction. That's All not. That. A, that's not. That's, that's a, crazy. That's a fucking yeah. Task. However, nigga. it's a necessary mm. because we be knowing about these battles like a month and a half, yeah. two yeah. months ahead of time. I got you, facts. So I mean, like, you know, uh, Twerk is a natural procrastinator. He, he does this. <laughs> that's been his whole career. <laughs> yeah. Right in last minute. Right. I remember B, I did an interview with him. B's was like, you can't say that. Right. It's work fine, but that's just what it is. It is what it is. That's what I do. I've, I've done it a couple times, too. So, so who won, though? I edged it this wave. Wave? I edged it, but it was like like I said. It's, uh, somebody can watch it now and feel like, no, it's working beat him. Second and third. Yeah. Second and third? Yeah. Yo, shout out to Sway. Sway, come on the show. Yo, twerk, real, man. twerk, you too, man. Come on, man. We've been doing this nah, for facts. too long, son. <laughs> and you know, long, that's what Sway huh? did. Sway... He, he talked about the gun. Oh, the yeah, gun. I heard about that. And that round, that was, I think, his second. Yeah. Yeah. The show was uh, entertaining like, like hell, man. Like, Sway, Sway showed that he's still one of the top out here doing it. I think, right. I think Twerk, got the, Twerk got a dope presentation. Literally, oh, yeah. But Sway worked like right. serious. Right. I just envision Sway like just talking to him as an older guy to a younger guy and kind of like schooling him, like pick your pants up. So that's kind of yeah, what he yeah, did. Right. That's kind of right. what he did. Yeah, but right, Twerk, like, Twerk had like thinking. like three rebuttals, like each in the beginning of the rounds. Every time Sway said something, he would rebuttal. He needed those. Them he just wrote them rounds. That's what kept that like right. that battle so close. It was like those rebuttals. It was necessary. Made him like okay, this nigga Twerk is he's he's scary. Mm. That's what's up. Nice. Yeah, what you do this weekend? Uh, a lot of just uh, working, putting things together. Uh, finished up on some videos, about to drop those, so that was good. <coughs> nice. Uh, a lot of work. Uh, not much play this not weekend. Not much play? Not a much lot play. of work. A lot of work. I played. I don't know about the rest of y'all. I played. <laughs> I ain't mad. I went to um, Haunted House in PA. Nice. Word. Yeah. My, my girl, her daughters, and like their cousins went to this old abandoned prison. Yo, the way it was set up, it was crazy. It was like a thousand actors in the whole joint, just popping out of walls. That's crazy. Falling Where you around. Said it was at? Um, it was in it was in Philadelphia. Cause my girl <coughs> been begging me to take her to a haunted. Yo, house. go to that one. That one is. Crazy. It was scary. It was like six. Nah, I walked through the shit giggling. You know me, but <laughs> but um, but everybody else was shook. It was like, oh shit! I'm walking to a room. Bunch of people, and I turn around, nobody behind me. I'm like, oh, okay, all right, cool. This is crazy. That's kind of crazy. You heard about, did you hear about there's a haunted house in, like, I think Tennessee somewhere, where it's that same concept, but they make you sign a waiver before you go in there? Yeah, we had to sign a waiver. Same. No, they was grabbing you and doing yeah, all types yeah, of shit. They could do whatever to you. The thing that pissed me off is they kept grabbing my girl. I was like, this thing is perfect, but you can't do nothing to her. <laughs> right. I'm like, why y'all you, keep grabbing her, man? Like, well, let's go, man. You know what I mean? The one I'm talking about, though, but they, they say that we allowed to do anything to. They be violating niggas, punching, hitting, shaving niggas' heads. Oh, nah, that's heads. different. That's it, different. It's like some Saw 3 shit. And then he sells the footage because they be on some real torture shit. Wait, 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 wait. You, you got to be a fan of torture. Shave your head. It's in the contract. We can do whatever to you. It's, it's one of the that's things. Crazy. I look at this shit online like, niggas are signing up for this shit? Yeah. I, it Boy. was fake shaving people. Like, they had the clippers, but they nah, didn't they, shave they nobody. they really be kidnapping niggas do all kinds of shit. And wow. it, matter of fact, they make it so gory and gruesome. They said, if you make it out of this shit, we give you 20 racks. So you know, oh, they, nah, you're not I heard making, about that. They know you're not making it. Oh, so, 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 that's so you got to quit? They so you, you can't quit. do nothing to They're them? They're going to violate you. It's in your concert, you can't do nothing to them. You can't do nothing to them. Nah. But they get to do stuff to you? They violate Hey, man, that's, oh, what, you, on, that's what you sign up for. Yeah, all right, cool. Sign, 20 bands, you do cool. it, man? The personality of a nigga doing that is a person that's into that shit. You're not, you're not going to be interested in that. As a, just, you're not. Right. If you look at this, you'll be like, I'm not doing that. I ain't doing that to me. The I'm just saying, you can't, you can't back out on niggas. Like, you survive. That's insane. <laughs> like, they ain't really doing nothing. Y'all like, like, yo, don't talk. Don't do it. <laughs> you ain't gonna see yeah, when they punch you in the back of your head, though. <laughs> <laughs> I was doing a little kind of shit. Niggas leaving there, like, they said, niggas be hurt. Niggas be fucked up. Yeah, I'm going to every room like this. Through mud. Bow, bow. Everything you ever see, <laughs> once they got that shit. That's crazy. different. That's I, was, I was like, that is different. People is pay different. for that. That's wild. They pay for that. Yo, there's people that like that type of. Nah, that's too much. Yo, the that's too much. This is cool, but I don't want to get hit. Yeah, like, <laughs> yeah, I don't want to get I'm not with that's that. That's like crossing the line. <laughs> nah, of course, so. that's crazy. A couple times, them niggas jumped out, and I was like, oh, 
Oh, nah. <laughs> you, can't, you can't do this what we coming from. This is what I came in Right. But nah, them whole houses was fun. Dope. Do this weekend. Weekend, I did the, uh, the I-9-5 show oh, yesterday. Dope. I was crazy on there. Fire. Shout out to them niggas, man. I like the fact. I like all hip hop platforms that niggas rap. I love it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, shout out to I-9-5. I'm a fan of rap, so right. I was appreciating that. What I was crazy on there. Kill? I did the G's up. Bows down. Oh, you know, that's fine. She, she going, yeah, yeah, I did that shit. Nice. I, I don't remember hearing nobody Free rap on that. Yeah, that's a fact. Nice. Free Max B, where the mother. Word. Did that. Then I did the Sway. You seen that shit I did on Sway? Sway in the morning, mm. a couple days the, ago. The, um, the, I peeped the that. Five, five Fingers is definitely. Yeah, yeah, I did that shit. Smoked it. That just make me kind of nervous, bro. But see, what yeah. I did, what I did, I said he, the first bit he played was hip hop. I said, keep me here in this hip hop shit. Yeah. I, I just wanted to rap. Don't mess, don't throw in the trap beat. You'd be like, oh shit. I, I had some boys though, <laughs> yeah. but I really didn't want to go there. I wanted to just rap. Yeah. Right. You know what I'm saying? So they all the beats he went to, I could still fit my rap. It was the in same the tempo. Right, right, right. Similar, close enough. Oh, you know what I'm saying? Cool. Look at this Sway though, man. He's one of the most coolest guys I've ever met. Facts, yo, Sway, and he I'm supports the culture. Love. Yes. All the way. He's a super yes. fan of it and support of the culture. That's, yes. that's what we like, need. Um, 100%. I went yeah. on a TRL, MTV, did a freestyle, and mm. he was the judge alongside uh, Little Kim. That's what's up. And um, when I, I won, right, obviously. Hey. And the, <laughs> you know. <laughs> I won. Regular stuff. Obviously. Well, yeah. I won, <laughs> and then um, I guess the, the prize was like have two hours in the uh, Great, you know, multi platinum studio, blah, 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 blah. Um, and then he was like, you know, two hours just not enough. So he bought an additional six hours from mm. the, uh, uh, out of his pocket. So and that's I, fire. I thought that was super Crazy. cool, you know what I mean? Like, that's dope. like the fact that he could just be like, you know, I, I see you and I, I want to contribute. So shout out to Sway, man. Yeah, shout out yeah. to Sway, man. Next Sway. time I go on this show, I want to rap. You have mm. to. You have to go to Sway with some brand new shit out the bag. Like, I'm killing everybody. Yes, you gotta be that. But I gotta remind her, like, yo, Sway, I wanna rap. You can't, you, can't, you, can't, tell a story. you can't go there and not rap. You don't gotta, you yeah, gotta tell them. You, you can't go there without rap. Yeah, right. No, I have. Word? And we went overtime. Like, he get out of here. here. I get up there and I start telling stories. Yeah. Right. And they, Tom just be flying. They be like, oh shit, man, we got Fran Drescher up. waiting. Mm. Right, right. Yo, uh, <laughs> Damn, we went over. Yeah, all right, Matt. Yeah, great That's interview. Though. I ain't gonna lie, Matt. Well, yeah, she's different. Yeah, go Man, right? Yo, um, she's, she's iconic. I saw. I, she's iconic. I was gonna say I saw that joint you did with uh, Benny the Butcher. Blow that shit crazy. Mm. I want to thank you, brother. Crazy. Shout out to Benny the Hope and Zelda, man. Um, speaking of that, I got a new tape called Oracle Three coming out. Mm. Got it again. He did most of the beats on there. Pete Rock got some joints on there. But that Benny the Butcher joint, that's on that shit. Yeah. Got Conway on there. How, how, how'd y'all work together? How'd that concept come about? Um, me and Benny just been cool just through, I mean, I met him through the rap shit, but mm -hmm. early. I didn't fuck with them niggas early. Is the joint with Joe on there too? Joe Button. Nah, that shit old. That was a while. I, that was I, a while just, put, I just put that up on some. For my, a lot of the fans I'm getting now is new. They just catching on to what I've been so doing. So you be throwing so stuff I try to reintroduce a lot of the classic shit and right. mix it with the new shit because they don't know. It's all, it sound the same. It's all timeless shit. Right. Right. Mm. So I put a lot of old, like that shit is old, see? You know what I'm saying? Right. So when niggas always brand new, like, oh, she got to rap it again. I'm like, yeah, he's rapping again. <laughs> Get into <laughs> it, nigga. <laughs> Click the link. <laughs> oh, <that shit. laughs> you know what I'm saying? So, nah, yeah, um, Speaking of new projects, yeah. um, how y'all feel about this Kanye West Gospel joke. Oh, uh, uh, I can keep it Jesus up. is king. I, I, I Jesus a, is king. I have strong opinions. I listen to it. I, mean, I ain't hear the whole shit yet, but I got opinions too I, without even saying I, shit. I, I heard the whole joint. I listened to it. Yeah. What do you think? I was on a plane. The sleep. Yeah. It was boring. Jesus is king. Nah, I'm oh. nah, <laughs> uh, nah, nah, nah. It was like, I, I wasn't really into it. And then I tried to listen to it again. I was like, yo, I listened to the, you know, joint with clips. I was like, all right. You know what I'm saying? Got well, malice I, back I out here. That's dope, though. I, cool. I, I kind of like that. I've been a Kanye fan. Yeah. I'm you know such a Kanye fan. Right. And I don't want to sound like a heathen, but I don't want to hear him rap about Jesus. Jesus I, walks, I, though. I, no, that's different. That was cool. That was different. How was it different? I, this is like <laughs> actual gospel music. Like, yeah. like yeah, Jesus I mean, he is got king. The... He was more, he used to. I liked him more his blasphemy shit where he was Jesus. Mm. You know what I mean? Yeah. 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 You already know no shit? Nah, way I more. I like that ignorance shit, man. Like, I like Kanye when he's on his, I don't give a fuck about what you say about but, me. But I know he blew up off a Jesus record, right? Jesus right. walks, no, but right. technically it wasn't about Jesus. It was about... 
He's just saying Jesus walks but, with me. Yeah, like, but you know what's like, crazy? Like I, God's I, with me. I, yeah, I, I, I didn't hear the whole but that's project. What on all those tracks. No, right. I was nah, assuming nah, it was going to be like that. I thought it would be like, like, like Jesus walks is technically a gospel record. But I thought okay. the whole album was going to be like, on some level like that, gospel, but just still rap. Just yeah. talking about. Now he's rapping yeah. on it, but he, I mean, he got a I lot of choir, orchestra, shit, really, some a lot straight of choir, a lot of. And it feels like some music. I hear the production is still very good because again, he's Kanye, right? Right. His production has always been great. Right. But um. I don't want to. I don't. I don't You're wanna, not into Jesus I'm, stuff. I'm into Kanye, and I love when he's unapologetically him. just himself. himself. When he's being and himself now. At this point, I don't really know who's himself. I like right? when he's talking. Because first you're like, "Hey, I'm Jesus. I'm a god. I'm this," and then you're like, "Well, no, I'm, I'm not a god. Jesus is king," and it's just. I don't know. I think, well, I think as an artist, don't you go through like phases? Hell yeah. Have you listened to any of his interviews? I agree with you. I agree with you. Right. Like, like, no, shout out to Lloyd Banks. Um, you know, I have conversations with him. He told me he's working on something that might not sound like the same type of style, but like <coughs> more of where he's he's at in life now. But what <laughs> is he like a religious album? Or nah, just it's not religious, okay. But, no, but you know, it's, it's like a baby. more mature right. when he had his life. Just for like, I'm a grown man. I, I but everybody people, matures. Yes, right. like Jay-Z. He's the best example for maturing with the music. Yeah, 444. Right. Because he doesn't... 444 yeah. is not... He does it's a whole mature music. album. Yes, right. it's more mature. He's talking about things that he's into now, property, art, things like that. Right. But, um, but when you got somebody that came in the game conscious... When they level up, where do you think they gonna go? Like Kanye, bro? Kanye? Like, Jay-Z came yeah. in the game conscious. He might nah, not have been talking about it. Well. No, the no, reason I say that, so, if you go look at 92 bricks at okay. the fallback. <laughs> just, just because you're <laughs> <some bad. laughs> conscious don't mean that you can't still cool. do other shit. Some people have great understand who they are, understand what they do, and move a certain way. But if you look at his the originators. He got pictures of Dr. York with all of this, so obviously they were, that was an answer to our community and all wow, of that. I feel so he was on that type of time since he was young. I'm not saying that, but that no, was. But he's always he's been from rapping Brooklyn. About the that was not, about but that's what these dudes did on them corners and all that. So he had his lessons. He understood. Nah, he had I, the I, seven I chain. Saying. He's bright. Yeah, he's a, he's 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 a, a smart guy. But um, he I don't I would never consider him conscious. conscious? Yeah. Like Jay-Z? common. I, yeah, conscious? Jay-Z, no. He's not conscious. He's money okay. conscious. Yeah. Oh, I'm, 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 not, I'm not saying he's lost. I'm just saying he's not conscious. I don't know. Like, like, like what? Like, like, con- then what is conscious? I wouldn't categorize. Like common. I don't, I don't know what you're trying to say. He's a body, right? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. So why so, wouldn't he be a conscious? That, so like, that's to, his level of that, conscious. That's what I'm saying. So it's like Jay-Z saying? was one of, okay. like, he's on that God shit. Right. Before a lot of people was. He's been rocking them seven chains. And then you go back. Like I said, to them years, you see these got conscious leaders in the video. Yeah, okay. You know what I'm saying? So, so, but that, so no, obviously he's... You got Kanye coming no, in with Jesus that, Walks. That means you, right? you practice right. religion. That means you believe in God, which is great. Not even practicing religion. This is like 5% of shit. This is God body shit. Right. This is not religious shit. This so is, he had records like that? If you go back then, in the music, Jay-Z been he on some Jews like... All the time. You know what I'm saying? It might not be just making straight like, yo... Y'all need to do this, but right. he's always been talking on that high you know, you know, level. Yeah. yeah, right. Yeah. He just wasn't feeding it to you like that. Like Nas was on that since day one too. Well, Nas, but Nas, was Nas, Nas confused you. You didn't know what he was. Yeah. He was you know still talking that shit. Israelite yeah, it's like, yeah, you're right, Israel you're right. It was, it was, it was, it was, like, it was you multiple. You didn't know where Nas, Nas was just one. That's true. You know, that's when true. Hood, it's like that. That's true. You got all different types of people around you. Like, okay, he's Muslim. He, you know what I mean. True. Everybody oh. on the same corner, just right, having right. conversations. I don't know. Jesus is king, though. I don't know, man. I think, like, T.I. kind of said something like that, I think, on his uh, Breakfast Club interview, where he was like, eh, it's a money grab. It's a thing. money grab? That's kind of how he basically was like, yo. I would look it's like at, a money thing. I would look you at know the, what I'm saying? the, the um... I'm a sick... Look, I like the quick... But I would look at that more as a money grab. He said it. Kanye said it. I was... I was like, I don't know if y'all been paying attention to his interviews, but he's basically explaining why he changed that. He said, I was basically broke, fucked up, needed the money. That's why I'm doing fucked up songs like that. He said, like he said, he said the music that I used to make right. won't help you stay with your family. It won't help you stay with your wife. It won't help you build nothing. Right. Like, basically, I was making devil music. Now I'm making God music. He said that verbatim himself. You know what I'm saying? So, But I say this. If, if he believe what he's saying, more power to him. Right. Most people, I'm saying I'm not a fan of religion. I believe in God, but I don't really believe in mm-hmm. religion yeah. at all. 
You know what I'm saying? Most people, when they play with religion, especially Christianity, it is a ploy to get black people in. Because yeah. there's a church on every fucking corner. Like who? We have like, like who, Graf? Well, right now we're talking about Kanye. Yeah. I I'm, I'm, I'm my nigga, though. So I'm not dissing Kanye at all. So I'm you don't think Kanye's doing that? No, but who do you I don't. I, have, I haven't heard the album. So I, 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 can't even, I can't even judge and it nah, objectively it, it, at all. But in general, yeah. most of the time, when, they, when somebody come out talking religion and Christianity shit in particular, right. they're aiming at a demographic. Correct. They're trying to get the blacks back. Because that's it. Just look, look at the South. Look at black people with fat Christianity from the beginning. You I can't necessarily put that on Kanye, though. I, I, that's what I'm saying. I don't know. Jesus I, walks. I haven't heard the record. But Jesus Walks wasn't a, a, a gospel record. It yeah, was that, just saying. It wasn't like, a religious it's record. It's like a record. I wasn't saying, playing that in the club, bro. God is but with Jesus Walks. You remember they used to play that in the club? It's exactly just about God. God. It's not, it's not a Christian record. Not no, none. They're not going to play anything from this record. album. They won't play nah, anything. It definitely from was this like album. a gospel type record. It was a gospel song. It just like, was like. But, it, but he wasn't proving no religion with yeah, no Jesus nah, he Walks. Wasn't. It was just about God. Like yeah, the, uh, Jesus to me. Walks was right. basically like, I'm living this life and God is with me. That's how I saw the record. That's how I took right. it. And, and the production was crazy. And then he made Look. three videos for it. And it was just so dope. <laughs> I listened to the project. It wasn't a gospel record. I listened to the project and I feel like a lot of the records, you know, he got his choir. You know, he's you know making making them pop, but uh, he's rapping on it too. Yeah, he I'm, is. I'm expecting just, the music to be good. Rapping about you know. Yeah, some shit like you like. Yeah, I want I want Kanye. You know, I got shit. Kind of he, he said one line. He was like, "Tell the devil it's on sight." I was like, "Yeah." Then, then he went back, and I was like, "Okay." Oh, <laughs> 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 So I mean, you know, it's good too. Niggas need vibrations like that. I'm That's not true. mad at positive shit. You I'm can't not mad listen to shit all the time. I stopped I mean, can, listening but. to Styles P. Because he talked he too much real shit? He was having a definite effect on my mood, bro. Styles <laughs> <laughs> yeah. say some real shit. He say some real shit. I mean, the, the joint thing he got with Talib, he was, he was kind of conscious on that. He be I'm slipping. black. He's a conscious nigga, though. He be slipping. He be dropping Of course he is. But I'm usually, Styles. shoot him in the head. Shoot yeah. him in the face. Yeah. We was talking about this last yeah. week. Right. That shit has an effect on you, bro. That's true. You're not going to be listening to that, get in a car accident, and get out and be like, well, let me get your insurance. Right. It's not going to happen. You're going to get up. What the fuck? Shoot him in the head. Shoot him in the head. I like I Kanye because he wasn't shoot him in the head, shoot him in the face. That's what I'm saying. That he energy's was never like good. that. He was, he, was just, he was really like spitting like from the heart of what he felt at that right. time. And every album was exactly what he exactly was going that. through. And, and this is another one. And I just want him to go through something else. <laughs> he just want to <laughs> like I, I want him to go through. I want his girl to like leave him or something. That's like, fucking hilarious. What? Damn, yeah. fit. Damn, yeah. destroying the man's family. family. Yeah. He got like four kids with him, man. So you could get a, a good three records. <laughs> <laughs> yo, yo, split up that no, whole thing. That's no, like Mary so J. Blige, make some shit right? Like. Mary yeah. J. Blige is fire when she's heartbroken. Oh, yeah. But when she's happy, happy she, she said that too. She said, like, y'all want me to be sad and yes. fucking heartbroken? And the fans like, yes, yes. Fuck she's your life like, up. You make that best music. So you can fuck our lives up too. That's fucking hell, but yeah. <laughs> But you know what's funny? Like, I, just I, I, like people don't know this, but I like I know Kanye. Like I came in the game with oh, that's crazy. So my, right. my my opinion is gonna be biased. Call or like him. honest to say, but tell him I don't wanna hear this shit. I, nah. <laughs> I do know it. Even when I was listening to the, that shit, he's an honest nigga in his music. That nigga be dead serious about what the fuck he's saying. I believe right. that. Right I moment. believe it. I believe he believes everything he's saying, yeah. though, from listening I to swear, him. I, I promise you. People don't know this. Years ago, Kanye set up a re- uh, meeting for me at um, Rockefeller. Nice. That's crazy. This before his first album drop, he heard me rapping. He was like, yo, I'm a cool hip hop. So I always been like, let me go check his first album out. When I heard right. he was rapping, I was like, the freestyles was a catchy. Mm-hmm. Around that, that time, album, I, was I, was like, I was with him hard this by then. a masterpiece. Yeah, that nigga's super, like, around that time, I was with him hard by like, You know, he actually taught me how to count bars. I don't even know it. That's crazy. I used to record in his crib, and I just had a million bars, not really knowing how to structure this yeah. shit. But he'd be like, I right, rap right here. I would rap like probably 50 bars. He'd be like, you know, 16 bars is way back there. I'd be like, yeah, I know. Yeah. Like, <laughs> but I was just going. coming up. I'm just front. But you, you was like that because I yep. didn't know how to count bars in the beginning. When he showed me where 16 bars was and I, I felt it out, I was like, oh, I felt where it was at. I didn't even know how to yeah. count them then. I just felt where it felt like 16 would be at. That's crazy. And I just went along with like, yeah, I'll just warm up, nigga. Do it again. <laughs> but I figured it out like, okay. Got mm-hmm. that joke. Stop right there. Mm-hmm. Yo, Bird. I ain't gonna lie. When, you, when I first started hearing like, um, well, one, my man Ja and Sav, Sav they used to manage um, Young M.A. Okay, yeah, yeah. That's the broad. They said they, said they said they they was around you first, and they was like, yeah, yeah. yeah. Graf, Graf, the one that slipped through the cracks. 
and something else. Yeah, happened. I was fucking with them way in the beginning. That's a fact. But when I started hearing your freestyles, and I got used to them, somebody be like, "Yo, you heard the grab freestyle?" I'd be like, "Ah, I got ten minutes." <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Sure. You just go and go and go and go and go. That's that's dope, though. I didn't know how to count bars in the beginning. I would just rap it. It didn't feel long when I was writing it. Right. And I recorded. I'm like, I gotta loop this beat. That shit is longer than three minutes. Word. I didn't know how to do that shit. You was going to a lot of people. I was always talking crazy. Yeah. You was going to M hard in the beginning. Because I was so competitive. I wanted to be compared to the nigga. Yeah. See, if I was business minded back then, I would have got with some of the niggas that I went at. Just on some business shit. That's it, right. I was so competitive. I didn't want to be cool with nobody. I wanted you to compare me. Like, I want to do songs with niggas to be just to be compared to me. Like, yeah. ah, I'm better. Like a battle rapper. I came in battle rap. <laughs> like, I, I came in, all my raps now, they still battle rap. I'm still dissing niggas through the whole fucking exactly. rap. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I don't get on the stage down there because y'all niggas is crazy. <laughs> but I can't. Exactly. Ring, 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 you dissing everybody. <laughs> just talking shit. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Word, word. But like, I came in an era, like, when I was battle rapping, it wasn't like, uh, um, y- y- I call it hip hop theater, which I made it. Y'all made it a fucking sport. Mm. Like that shit is an art form and it should be treated as such. That yeah. shit is amazing what the battle rappers today do. When I watch y'all on stage, I'm like, talented to the point, I don't even think y'all niggas know what y'all doing. That shit is like, for me as a fan of the game, it's literally like theater watching what the fuck y'all do. It ain't just spitting bars. Right, bars, right, yeah. Right. It's like the performance, theater, it's, mm-hmm. this shit is, everything around it. It's like yeah. genius shit though to right. me. I'm like, yo, this shit is like, that ain't regular brainwave shit. The average rapper can't do that. Yeah. Right, absolutely. Right. Definitely not. You're getting smoked in the ring because you can't do that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So when I was battle rapping in the, in the beginning, that shit was just the bars and then potential violence, nigga. It was, yeah. no, it was none of the sport part. You know what I'm potential saying? Potential violence. My I, I like that. Potential violence. When, when we were doing all the beat cap, I was telling him in the car driving over here. When, when I was doing all the beat cap, uh, we was rapping like on beat cap on like, um, what's the shit? Um, like the... Video music box type right, of shit. Sure, yeah. There was no fucking internet wasn't popping like that. Yeah, right. And we go into all the battles, deep, ho, ho, everybody gripped up, ready to do whatever. We young, right, dumb, and stupid, ready to go. That's how it was. You know what I'm saying? Because it wasn't no sport. Whoever you battling, you're planning on not being cool. You know what I'm saying? Right. Who is that? That's, That's my five. man. That's my man. Uh, Fire the car. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. How you doing, sir? What's good with you, bro? All right. What's up, man? My brother. Hey, you know what? What's up? Hey, how you doing, bro? All right. What's up, nigga? Good boy. You had it right on time. Almost kind of, sort of. <laughs> Harlem Cuts, 2310 2nd Avenue. 2310 2nd Avenue. Woo. Nah, continue, Greg. Nah, I was saying, um, back then we was battling, man. That shit was aggressive. Like, if you was, if you didn't have the slam on, you would come with the, the crew. Right. You're probably going to leave with your ass, but right. there was a couple of battles like I was in. You said the wrong thing. But you I always nice. said the wrong thing. Yeah. I, and the way I used to battle back then, <laughs> you know how niggas get mad and do the screaming shit? I would always rap soft with my hand in my pocket and, like, laugh. So the shit would be funny. Niggas would laugh at the person. Right. So you're like, you're gonna want to fight. Fight. Yeah. And we came to fight, cause it's like we young that's, and just that's like. That's what it is. Yeah. That. Damn. Yeah, it was, it was, that shit was. I met a one battle I did. Didn't have no gun. Wasn't deep. And I was like, oh, I'm gonna get fucked up in here tonight. I'm, I'm going. I'm, <laughs> I'm clearly winning. And right. he's deep as shit in there. Right. And I'm hearing niggas say, Yo, this is about. I'm like, Oh shit. I don't think I'm gonna make it. The door was like really far where I was at. I was like. I ain't gonna make it out this shit without an ass booking. Like, damn, no, I got whack verse? Let me spit a whack verse. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm, I'm, I'm gonna kill you anyway to take the ass with it. One thing saves me, I happen to be good enough that the other crowd, other side of the crowd that wasn't with that nigga said, I touch him, we ride it for the nigga. Oh, no. Nice. Like, That's crazy. Because <laughs> that door look mighty far from here. <laughs> That's crazy. Word, son. Oh. But to see where it's at now, like, um, we was talking about this thing earlier with um, the battle rappers. Oh yeah. The, what, do I, does anybody know their name though? Who's that? Oh, uh, the guy who spit on yeah. the picture? Yeah. I don't know their name, but I saw it. I don't know, know their name either. Nobody know their name. But you know they're going viral. Right. They was doing some stupid <laughs> shit. I mean, he pulled out pictures and you say, "Oh, you're dead on." on. Yeah, spit on. Pulled it. out on um, a picture. That's crazy of her though, bro. Spit on I, 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 I can't fuck with that. I'm hooking off on you. I can't deal with that. But from what I understand, though, that was too much. But from what I understand, <laughs> they had an agreement. They agreed to this so that the battle could get attention. So deep, man. Mm. Get it? I can't agree to that. Not, my, not at my expense. I would have been like, hey, we would agree to something else. Well, well you missed it already. Family you won, but if you was misfit trying to get on, yeah, are you willing to be I like? I would have pushed him in his face to be noticed before I let him do that to my mom. Pulling out the picture. Bro, he got relatives that gotta watch that shit. Yeah, that's like, right. Like, it's one thing to We did it to go viral, mom. Don't worry but about it. I didn't do nothing. You pulled out the pic. It's art. 
like, but but but, but let's let, let's talk about it. It goes viral, right? Mm-hmm. What does that do for them? They got attention now. They got attention now. What? They better get use it. They can make sure you get another battle. Are you gonna get booked? They gotta go for I don't versus know, somebody man. else. Well, we don't, don't know. know, but are you gonna do that to everybody that you battle? Platforms you like this is talking about yeah. it, and people will go search. That's it. real, right? They might, they might get on. Who cool. knows? But they not getting a dollar out of it though. That's, it's, so it's ridiculous. But if they did it for niggas like us to talk about them on platforms like this, then right. they it's working. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It's working. Yeah. It's, yeah. It's, yeah. It's, the only bad thing is you don't know their name. Level you want? Right. You can think it is different. Right. You know what I'm saying? We, so they, they must look at that like how you looking at it. So is that the new money attention? Of course. It's fucking It's 2019. Clout. Niggas want niggas. That, that, that's you know what's crazy? That's you crazy. know what's crazy? I gave an example. There was a chick that um had a big internet following, right? And I was going to work out a situation where to post certain things, like videos just to promote them. Right. We was going to pay her well. Like a cool people going to pay her well. Mm-hmm. She said, I don't want any of the money. Just post me. She's like, I don't want the money. Just, yeah. post, just post me. That's she, money. She, she just wanted. She just wanted to be posted. Mm-hmm. Attention is the new currency. But I was, was going to pay her one time. I was going to make a career. I was, was going to pay you forever because she had right. like mad Facebook pages and they was all maxed out. And she just spent her whole life. Like she did a reality show because she was like spending her whole life on Facebook, just writing nonsense. But she had every page, like twenty pages maxed out and do this shit all day. I was like, you need to like use use this platform for something that can yeah. make a nigga like Makes, me some money. Because you're right. doing some bullshit. You're talking about just pussy and looking for dates. I could pay you. Fuck these niggas. It is. Mm-hmm. I mean, but, but with everything on social media, uh, attention is needed to be an influencer, right? Because people do get paid for this, right? That's so what like, I'm saying. They say, hey, Misfit, I'll give you $500 if you wear my t-shirt every day on your Instagram yep. for five But you're going to take the bread. That's of what course. I'm saying. Like, it's right. business. So I'm going to be on there like, yeah, this is the greatest shirt in the world because I got paid. Right. But um, I she mean- She turned the money it, down, though. She's like, nah, I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> she turned the she she money down. She I'm talking about paying on a regular basis. Just give me some more attention. Out. She wilded out. She wilded out. Um, I was like, all right, fuck it. I'll post you. But fuck I mean, it, I guess free, on some level, like, of attention is just... But my opinion is also, like, every, you know how people say, you know, there's no such thing as bad publicity. Like, good, bad, is all publicity right, 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 is good. Right, 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 right. Nah. Which is true. They say that, but it's not true. It's not true. They say that. The only way it's not is if you're a pedophile. Yeah, yeah. That's the only thing. That's good publicity right there. Being a snitch on the table now, because Takashi got hot of snitching than he ever did with a hit record. You can snitch now and get a deal. Them niggas on fire snitching. But not all. That's not good attention. No, that's not good. But I bet it's still it's still working. He got a bag out of that. He's hot of snitching. He got a bag out of that, man. It's not I, good th- attention, this but what, it's still... What I'm saying. Coming from an era where... equal to dollars. If you was doing certain things, you didn't want the attention? Of course not. Right. That's not good attention. You think what I'm saying? Well, the, the, well the no, time, it's not the, good. The but it's attention. Changed. She's saying it's attention. It's, it's not good to... It's He's not more popular now as a snitch. Like a, Perspective but like a snitch, yeah. on fire, snitching. Yeah. And Matt, would you, would you he, got more, he got more. He's no, on definitely fire. not. Yeah. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Definitely not. But, oh, oh, but that's attention, though. No, nah, but I'm not. I'm not the trolling nigga. Part of I'm not. I'm so you wouldn't want that type of attention? Hell no. I'm not that. I'm just. I'm the. I do a record. Watch that nigga's crap. You do a record with Tekashi. I'm gonna do a record. It's about to go viral right now. I'm gonna diss that nigga the whole verse. I'm not doing record. We talking about snitches, killing snitches. I'm not doing that. I don't want to be in the same room with that nigga. Name on it is such clickbait. Facts. Like anybody will click whatever yeah. that man's yeah. name is. Let me tell you on, something. He's snitching. His and fucking like, his snitching audio got more streams than his music. Yeah. That nigga's on fire. The snitch boy, how to snitch yeah. ever? And that's yo. Platinum. That's the platinum in the car. That's the fuck that's you mean? I'm just like fact. yo, you heard that name Takashi? That's a fact. <laughs> yeah, it was shot and shot. It was, it was everybody. <laughs> that's a fact. Nigga, that's so shot and shot. It was shot. That's a fact. He got out the car. That's a fact. He got out the car. 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 Yeah, they offer them deals now. Ten million dollar deal. Any, any turn. And then what? He asked Diddy to be his manager. Diddy gonna do it. I bet you. Diddy's not gonna do it. He's a money machine. He'll do it. Diddy's not gonna do it. He'll do it. You think Diddy's gonna do it? Oh yeah. He's trying to sign Diddy as a management deal to the biggest. Diddy the street nigga. Who's to say he don't know? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Diddy the street nigga. He'll get a single and then drop him. He'll get a single drop him. He might do for the attention. I don't know. I don't know. I really don't know. I mean, we are gonna see. If Diddy manages him, we're gonna know. <laughs> you know That's a fact. It's not gonna be a secret. Gonna go he, he might create a a, a, a subdivision and do it through that, Rats like through somebody else, right? Or be like, so yo, I'm brother that love. I got show love for everybody, even if they make mistakes. Man, I changed. Damn. I don't know. 
I don't, I don't know. know. But whatever, like, how many documentaries are there about Sammy the Bull? And he's a known snitch. Do you know Sammy yeah. the Bull just did an interview recently, right? Look, that did like a million in like two look, days. Look at so that. Saying snitches so and he's like, talking his shit too. It's like, like, no matter what. No, no, no. Sammy's a tough snitch. Yeah, yeah. I, I, yeah, I, yeah. He was a gangster. Yeah, I'm yeah, told. You, you know who I'm at? I'm over here. Come get me. Yeah, yeah he's like, come see me. And he's like, y'all think I'm not Sammy no more? That's what he said. He said, yeah. He was talking. He was talking crazy. And he like, yo, I snitch because niggas was trying to make me eat everything. I'm not eating everything. Y'all niggas all helping me do this shit. Y'all want me to take it? That's what he said. He I said the niggas was like, yo. I'm not going to. Which is crazy. But Sammy the Bull, he looked like he snitched. He was a gangster. He did all that. Oh, that's that's not, but he said yeah, himself. He, know, he, I, we know he said, y'all niggas say I'm an animal, but I was not the only niggas killing niggas. Like, I'm not the only nigga that was pulling the trigger. Which is true, but when you but when you join something like the mafia, when you join the mafia, you got like an unwritten code. Oh, yeah. And you can't be a snitch. Nah, he said it's like a written code. I don't call gangster niggas. That's some gangster niggas. Stop. They kill each other. So where's this going, man? That's a fact. Where's this going, man? Silence. That's a fact. How, how, how do we even get to this point <laughs> where we saying you could be a tough snitch? It's the, nah, bro. You said it's, it's that. not cool, bro. <laughs> no, no, a snitch is no, a snitch. Cool. You could be tough. You could be pussy. No, you could be like you're not cool. A, you're scared. You're not cool. You're not of cool. doing time. Period. Yes. Yes. Period. Cool. Or you Some just don't do want to do the time how, for um, your crime. What's what's the name? The um, Nicky Bonds. Yeah, he snitched. Mm-hmm. He did it and told the niggas he was snitching before he told them. He said, I'm gonna snitch on you, bitch ass nigga. Watch this. He did it. And so I'm being tough about it. He didn't even do it. Oh, yeah, and the bitch ass do it. In his head. Right. He did it like, I watch what I do to you, fuck boy. Uh, that and type he did of it shit. Over women. I don't know what he did it over, but he did it on some revenge shit. Mm. So it was like, uh, I'm not glorifying it at all. I'm from a different kind of club. But and some, then some niggas be snitching, be straight killers, but they still yeah. told no, him. Nick, 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 Nicky did it over women. Mm. Couple of chicks that he was seeing. Started seeing of the niggas. people that were still out and popping. And they got mad. And he got mad and said, you know then what? watch this. Out. <coughs> the nigga, <laughs> what you AZ in the face. The nigga said, look at the fun flex. All kind of shit. He home. But he, also, but he, he home act, turning he up. Like he, that's an example of what I'm trying to say. Like, he saw, he snitched. He done caught hella bodies. He said he only snitched on niggas in D.C. Hey, I'm, I'm, and I'm he, he ain't snitched on nobody else. This. <laughs> this is, all right. You from the street. You from the street. You from the street. Now, I was you from Long Island, but you Long got your Island, hands dirty but before. you know, it's, <laughs> it's a nice suburban area. Before. You know what I'm saying? But there's street niggas everywhere. I, I think that um, <laughs> I think just like with slavery, how they divided people and disrupted the loyalty. I think that's what all this snitching shit is about. Of course, we're gonna divide all of y'all. When something happened with us. We stand together. Oh, a cop shot a little kid, the whole precinct is riding with that cop. Yep. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Was that blue wall of silence? Yeah, and I and I dare I'm, I'm you to be the one cop finish. that's gonna stand out and say something about it. Mm-hmm. We got the um a thousand, a thousand black, what's the name of it? A thousand black officers. Mm-hmm. It's like a, a, a organization where that. they speak up about stuff like that, mm-hmm. but you never see them in the newspapers, you never hear about them on the news, no nothing. Oh, they exist. Like that. You know what I'm saying? So this, this this whole snitching thing is like, it's, it's only, just a disruption it's, of loyalty. I'm about to tell you well, that. Well, of course, that's what they, they promote, do in the interrogation they, they, room. They're they like, promote, hey, your friend said this about you. You, you going to let them do that? That's how they, that's the tactic. It, it, that's a straight Divide tactic. Cause look at what they promote. Even from like, I remember um, Chaz, rest in peace Chaz, back in the days when he was watching like the army movies, they're promoting no treason, no snitching. They, they, they're, they're feeding you this propaganda to stand mm-hmm. loyal to your side. Right. Right. Police, well, same what shit. was Trump shit they, about John McCain? Then he go over there and What's tell. What's the lower? All that shit. All that he shit. He went and told. And y'all going, you know, Nobody Trump coming at him like this nigga snitch. They not promoting that. <laughs> he went across seas and snitching on niggas. Gave the whole base and shit. I'm crazy. You know what I'm saying? So that's. But how, do we support that? Nah, I'm not fucking with a snitch. Like when you in the club, when I'm in the club and I hear Takashi record now, it's like I can't fuck with him on no level. Right. That's crazy. I mean, that. Even you know though I mean? niggas justify how they want to, it's like nigga. If you, you choose this life, it is what it is. You got to take the consequences that come with the well, shit. Well, they were but sleeping they on this girl and they and were so, violating him. They was taking his money and hey, bro, you wasn't I saying mean, that when you were running around with the gangster shit. If you I, with the shit, you, you got to do it all the time. He was forced into that. He was a child. No, 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 no. no, 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 no. I can't really say it's forced because I just heard an audio of Shadi saying, yo, you the one. We following you, my nigga. 
You can't be the king of New York getting robbed. We got to go at these niggas. We following you, my nigga. Yeah, because he's the money. But I'm, I'm saying, though, I'm going to tell so you. So, obviously, he's not just a peon. Because the gangster niggas is like nigga putting him in position who, who to made be the leader. Popping. It's kind of like, you be like, yo, you're a punk. Cool. I'm going to back you up. Cause you pussy, yeah. But you gotta give me all your fun. But if you still, but if you don't pussy, believe, his, he his don't believe really he don't believe he's pussy in his own head. They did real. Nah, he knows they he's did, pussy. They did street shit you in front of him. Yeah, exactly. Yes. Which they never should have did. Correct. But Correct. they thought he was that. Like, like a little sweet. handy blindfold, like yo, son, take this blindfold, yeah. put it on. <laughs> yo, come put the headphones mm. on this nigga, and then they go do what they do. You nah, know what I'm saying? Like it was too crazy. I'm gonna give you a better example of how I look at it. Cause when I came in the game. I was young, from the hood, whatever the fuck. I had all the power in the world. I had all the gangsters with me. Right. And I'm young. I'm like 19. Right. All, I got first deal, 100000 What the fuck a 19-year-old doing $100,000? That's 000? crazy. Right. First deal, I had all this fucking money. I've got new guns to everybody. I got none of the gangsters exactly. with me. I have no... I, I'm fucking Alpo and paid in full. That's in my, <laughs> right. I swear to God, I watched the movie like, that was my brain, like... Remember, remember when Cameron was like, what's the purpose of having, having all, these all this soldiers. power? Right. Yeah. All the soldiers you hey, can't you use, it. use it. That was my mentality. Yeah, so I understand what Takashi was going through when he got on. Yes. Right. I still had fucking sense, though. Even at that age, with the same amount of power he had, you don't start with a bunch of niggas unless you're ready to do that. Mm. But you ever you can't just him? lean on niggas because they, they, they got juice. You're going to fight there. You're going to bust the hammer. That cannot even articulate himself. No, he does nah, not. He's very smart. He's not. He's not. He's doing that on purpose. No, he's really an idiot. I give him no I don't think he's an idiot. 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 He chose to wild out. I don't think he's dumb, yo. I'm not giving no excuses. You made the decision that I got all the money, I got the power, I'm going wild out. Yeah. Right. Because I picked and choose who I wanted to pick on. I didn't just wild out and just fucking start with everybody because I had fucking sense. Right. He chose to wild out. He's just right. like, I'm going to, you a blood, wow, these are blood, but you still start with this nigga, this nigga, you commented on Jay Prince shit. That was the issue. You starting to start with Jay Prince and them niggas, you're wild. Right. <laughs> you, you ain't going to be the nigga to ride, you're going to rely on niggas. You, you, you stepping out of what you even willing to do. Any right. beef I started, I'm like, I could beat that nigga up. I'm going for it. I'm not. I'm not playing on leaning on niggas. Right. So if I'm looking at a nigga like, he might win. I'm not jumping out the window because I'm leaning on niggas. Like right. you, he chose to be to that little. Yeah, yeah come suck on. My nah, nah, you're not like all, all of the crazy. Y'all, I'm part of y'all gang. Y'all got to yeah. do something. Yeah, y'all got to ride for me because I'm about to start all this shit that I can't handle. Absolutely, they they kind of got course. blind about the money too. Of course, I know all them niggas. So it's like it was the money, but right. he made the decisions though. Like you, you have to know. I think they all made those decisions. They all did, cause yeah. there, there was records. I remember there was there was records I wrote right when I came in the game, cause I was reckless. I ain't gonna front. Certain lines I wrote about certain niggas. Chaz would be like, Nah, take that out. And I'd be wanting to say it bad as shit, cause I'm like, Fuck them niggas. He like, Nah, take that out. I'm like, Why? Like, Nah, take that out. Why well, well, so I do too. Though. He's wild, cause well, I just I'm just from the hood. And I just I was I'm a competitive nigga, and it's about especially that era of rap. It's about us. Fuck everybody. It's like my crew versus. Well, Everybody. You never was like, fuck. damn, some of the shit I say, these niggas might, you know what I mean, see me in the street and shit might be on. I was hoping they wouldn't at, see at me. At that time. At that time. I, I wanted to smoke bad. Right. I wanted niggas to say my name so I could so just did. go. I wanted it to be like a real battle and go there with somebody. That, right. I, was start, I was trying to start an issue. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So I know what he's going through, but it's like, he's well aware what the fuck he's doing. That, don't make no excuses for that nigga. Whether he know he saw, I don't think he, in his mind, he believes pussy. I don't believe that he thinks that. And... I think he's very aware of the decisions he made. He like, I got these gangsters, I got this money, I'm going for it. Well, yeah, but that's the thing. That's what I'm saying. Like, whether he was uh, conscious of, of him being pussy, right? <laughs> <laughs> I feel like... I, if he I knew feel, he was pussy. Yeah. I feel like on some level, like you said, like you felt like, oh, I could beat this nigga, so I'm going to go for it, right? Right. I feel like on on under any and every circumstances... He knew that he wasn't going to be the one retaliating. I don't so respect that though. He that's can what I'm do whatever the yeah. fuck he wants. That's my point. He He's not the one that's going to ride out. A bunch out. of dudes. I, I can't respect it though because you know that. For him. Yeah, that's why he right? told the nigga go shoot at Chief Keevan and then snitched on him. I'm like, right. yo, yeah. I told him to go shoot him. Right. So walk him up. Right. Like, that's, so, I, don't, I don't respect that. Yeah, that's, crazy. That's, 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 that's pussy in itself though. That's, you you, you riding up in their coattails for real. You laying on the gangster coattails. You walk, you sliding them shit. But you think about this boy. That's crazy. This boy. No, no, Come but on, this boy was literally just a regular little kid working in a deli when somebody damn. scooped him and said, hey, do you rap? No, I don't rap. Wasn't even a rapper. And said, you know what? You got the look. You should rap. Told the boy to rap. Yeah. Got him into it. Yeah. Then these blood dudes that are like, oh, okay. No, dude, I dude. see a little bag. Let me be your manager. 
And you know every MC in this in this in this place knows every time you look talented, look like you got something going, a manager's hopping on your back. Let me be your manager. Let me be your manager. Back. I had an 80 of those in my freaking whole life. Right. And then they jump on them when they start percolating, and it's like, cool, we got your back. You we got a point. Do I'm front. I'm, I'm mm-hmm. gonna comment to that. You got right. a point because he is young, and if niggas don't straighten you out or mislead you, you could end up like that. That's I right. had real yes. niggas around me that was like, stop that, stop exactly. this, stop okay. that. Okay, right. If niggas green like everything they, I was doing, they, they oh, was I'd, a, it'd exactly. been a mess. I've been locked up too. But, but I, had, I still had more sense than that though. I wasn't just strong with any and everybody. I was a smart street nigga. I was always right. balanced. I wasn't just... But see, there, there's people... He, I go to Chicago, that's nigga. That's the difference. But, but that was trolling, because he went over there and did fake shit. Yeah, well, you wasn't really on a block at 10 o'clock. He popped out. But it was about how I looked. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, but that's fake. It's the perception. Yeah. So you know what you're doing. But you to fake it, you're smart enough to do that. But we couldn't do that even back in the day, right? Pull up, put it on Instagram and, and say, fake it, we though. on somebody's block. We would actually have to be on that's that block. That's my point. Not put it Niggas on Instagram. Niggas would have to confirm it. They would have to see me there, Yeah, yeah. fight me, and then everybody would talk about it yeah. word of mouth. Then I would, then I would, but if he did that, <laughs> I could respect it. But you nah. made a conscious decision to troll niggas. Correct. <laughs> and no other niggas gonna ride for you. Right. That's not what's up. It's not. It dangerous. Not. I can't. It's, it's beyond dangerous. Not. I was in LA when he had issues with the time nigga. I saw it though, I was like, you knew? It's like I knew it was going. Morning. I was like, this, this, this is going. It's like four in the morning. Ain't nobody outside. Like, I didn't even think about that. I was like, it was like wow. Yo, I got actually mad because I was when I first saw that that nigga video and he was in Brooklyn with all them niggas behind him. All that. I said, damn. I wonder how niggas from Brooklyn feel. Yo, at seeing first, that, I was like, I was like, like to be like, yo, this is the face of the new Brooklyn. New age, no, hip hop, no one. New York. Stop I'm just saying, my friend. Two fucking niggas like this. Initially, I'm just saying. They're not claiming that nigga. I'm just saying, though. Popularity wise, no. you're not going to say Takashi no. was like one of the biggest rappers no. in New York to come in from Brooklyn? No. Stop, 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 stop. Never. Never. Who said that? I'm Never. Never. Okay. He, so the face of New York? Bro. He, no, he was no. making no. 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 He like, was making niggas was doing this and he was the king of New York you know and doing all that shit. Not in the street. Nobody in Brooklyn ever said that. Nobody okay. in the streets But I'm talking about popularity wise. No. People that was making money off he was like, him was you know saying that. No. Okay. Anybody right. who was from wasn't, Brooklyn no, no, knew no. exactly who the, the killers was. Because I know everybody right. who's in charge. You understand? Okay. So it's like, I'm looking at this video, but I know this guy and this guy and this guy is the ones. Right. And those guys. And they know what it is. They behind. Yeah. Okay. know what it is. Okay. So we knew who who was the top. So y'all knew just a gimmick. Y'all like, okay. Honest, from yeah. the time I heard the gang name, I was like, okay, I know the usual. Yeah, you know, you know, exactly. you know every single one of them niggas. Right, so you know, know what time it is. Like, as soon okay. as you heard Trey we know them. I was like, okay. Yeah. When you from out here, you know what time it is. Like, okay, it's a bag like, okay. for niggas. Correct, I get it. Correct. They, they, you know what? It's a great idea. First thing that came to my head is where they get this kid from. Get him in a ring. You know what? I'm like, where they get this kid from? Because especially if you rap in Brooklyn, you know every rapper. Okay. You know them. And I didn't know him, so I knew they just grabbed him from somewhere okay, and placed okay, him. Okay, okay, okay. Facts. Because anybody from the underground, we know each other. Right. We, we've been doing this shit for a minute. Right. So you know who's coming up, who's hey, about man, to come up. He's young, though. He got I'm all like 19 or shit. He was yeah. 22. Yeah. 22. Well, now, 22, now, yeah. Now. So he got on like 19, 18 there. Yeah. Yeah. A little boy. Very yeah. young. Right, correct. So yeah, you got to think about it. like you said, he was 19. Right. But 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 then, see... We we look at somebody like him and say, oh, he was young. But then when we don't think, stop to think that yo Nas was like young, seventeen, than that, eighteen, mm, yeah, when he got on. Y'all yeah. was more mature though. Y'all gotta look it, at it back then. Time. So dudes was more mature at nineteen than they are now. I'm not, at I'm not excusing it. Keep it right. Right. I'm not excusing it. That's what I'm saying. No excuses. Run away. I'm not excusing it. He made them decisions. Like yeah. right. you young and you gotta still learn and you learn the hard way. I mean, a lot of niggas throw your life away at that age because you Facts. don't know shit. That's Facts. like think about it. If you meet younger than battles, could have easily did something. Mm-hmm. Niggas gripped up, ready. Yeah, right. and you young and done with that yeah. young energy, you can easily go somewhere. Bow, bow, nigga, fuck yep. you. And now you locked up, and you got to do fifteen joints. You sitting there like, damn, damn. I fucked my life up yep. because I'm. I, I, was, I was trying to keep the hype. reputation up. Kind of like Chi Ali, he said the same thing. Like, yeah, it was an emotional. That was a different. That was a different. It was still of situation. an emotional, impulsive thing. Yeah, but that was, was like that was more personal. That was yeah, that was regardless of the person, it wasn't in the public. Yeah, that's true. You dig what I'm saying? But there's times like we walking out of a show and another crowd is acting too rowdy. Right. Yeah. And you just get into it. You know what I'm saying? Right. Because it was like, who do you mean? Why are they making all the noise? Mm-hmm. Too much ego stuff. But right. since, since we're on the topic of like the drama and all that shit, um, you were signed a black hand. Right. Who? And that's crazy. That 50? Yeah. Who's shit playing? 
That's all I'm Was, no, was there a problem between y'all and 50 when he popped? It was never a problem. Because it was it oh. was your manager he was talking about on Mini Men. It was. It was. Right. And um Wait, wait, it was who? Slim. Oh, okay, yeah. yeah. Right. Okay, yeah. okay, okay, yeah. I'm a, I'm a I'm a fast forward then rewind. Like when I did the you heard the So Brooklyn Freestyle I did? Yes. You heard that shit, right? In in the So Brooklyn Freestyle, I said, ignore whatever fifty cents say about him, right? And the whole internet posted it as a G unit diss. Mm -hmm. Okay, I saw that. I yeah, yeah, that. I saw that. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah. It was never <laughs> a diss. See, like, Chad, like for me, Chaz, me and Chad got our own relationship as grown men. He was almost like a more like a father to me than a, 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 a manager. You know what right. I'm saying? And 50 has his own relationship with him. Right. And nobody can nobody can't tell you about nobody got a relationship with. They got their own relationship, I got my own relationship with him. Right. My depiction of him is he's a real nigga, he's a gangster, he's official. I'm always gonna represent his legacy to the wheels fall off. Right. That's who he is to me and to everybody that knows him. Right. It's a hundred, he's one of the most gangster niggas on the planet. Right. You know what I'm saying? 50 definition of him is going to be a little different. He had a different experience. Whatever he experienced with him, he don't have the best things to say. Right. So when I said in the record, ignore whatever the fuck would you say about him, I'm being literal. It's not a diss. I'm saying ignore what he says and don't let it, don't let it affect your opinion of Big Homie because he's official. Right. If you hear what 50 had to say about him, treat it as that's his opinion. He has the right to his own opinion. Everybody got the right to their own opinion. You know what right. I'm saying? I'm not mad at 50 for anything. Right. I don't even think 50 knows this, but nobody on that side is mad at him in, in a real way. Wait. Where like they have an issue with him. It's not it's never been an issue. Even all the years when he was saying shit about Chaz, Chaz always spoke highly about the nigga behind closed doors. Right. So and I, I never knew the real story between him and 50, because I never asked, because I felt like it wasn't my business. It wasn't and I, I never knew 50 enough to really ask either. I just know 50 felt how he felt. The G and the niggas felt how they felt. And it was what it was. Was there ever a conflict between y'all? Me and Fifth? You and G on the period. Um, not like in a real way, like we met up and fought or some shit. I mean, it was like tension and shit niggas say because whatever the fuck was going on with the feelings affected my whole career. So whether like the hoodies about, oh, 50 blackballing you, 50 blackballing you. I don't know yeah. if he was blackballing directly. I just think all that energy that was going on was making niggas in yeah. the industry say, we gotta pick sides. Yeah, yeah, they, yeah, they pick sides. Yeah. They did. They said we gotta pick sides. Right sometimes it's not like a direct somebody calling, like, "Yo, don't yeah. fuck with them niggas." It's, exactly. it's just people That's knowing. I mean. Like, if these yo, two guys you fuck don't get with this along, nigga, we gonna pick the nigga that we're gonna the pick the nigga. Of course, that we, we gonna we try to make money off of. This you know nigga's I mean? diamond. He's helping us sell tickets. Yep. Spent all. We going with this nigga. Right. So, and you right now he feels if he's not cool with somebody, it is what it is. Right. So, he don't he he make you choose. You know what I'm saying? Without even saying it. So, I don't think it was an issue. He was. That's in my personal opinion. Some niggas might say different. But I don't think he was personally trying to blackball. I think that's just niggas made a choice and we got pushed to the side right. because they're going to rob a son. So whatever he felt about their relationship, he felt. He had the right to his opinion. I have nothing to say about that. I have nothing to do with that. I don't even know the story. Story. So I can't even really talk mm -hmm. about two grown-ass men's relationship. That's not my place to do. You know what I'm saying? So right. was their relationship uh, musically or like personal? Between me and Son? No, between uh, 50 and Slim. He used to manage him before he managed me. He used me. to manage him. Okay. Yeah. But whatever happened between the relationship yeah. happened. But I, all I know is that Chaz had love for the nigga still. Right. To the end. He never was mad at 50. His energy carried on throughout the, like, the crew, per se, because niggas wasn't really mad at him. Even now on Instagram, I see certain niggas still liking the shit. I still like shit. I like the nigga, Fifth. I know, I, I know him. We never really kicked it, kicked it, but we, we cool enough when we stay with up. Yeah. He never was... I never had an issue with them. We're not enemies. Of right. course, I'm, I'm black hands, so I'm riding with the, with the team, but the team doesn't have an issue with you in a real way with Wait. beef. Right. Dad's one of the strongest niggas in the city. If it was real beef, nigga, it, it would have it would have shown. It would have been something else. You don't have beef with the nigga being in the same city for 10 years and nothing's happening. Okay. It, he never had an issue, and he never believed that son was ever black. So, so let's say you do a record with Lloyd Banks. Ain't going to be no 50 posts later? Like... Look at these niggas. <laughs> you know what I'm I mean, that nigga plays chess. I have no fucking idea. Yeah, right? I, I like Banks. I like. As a matter of fact, I, I I took cheap shots at Banks on some battle rap shit because I wanted to battle rap with the nigga to smack. So to the camera yeah. round. Yeah. To the camera yeah. round. You heard it here yeah. first. Oh, uh -huh. Rap versus Lloyd <laughs> Banks going down <laughs> next year. State <laughs> tour. Starting here. Yeah. Mike's for the pin. Right? It's going Let down. me tell you how that started though, because the nigga. <laughs> <laughs> I think he. I think somebody said to him on Instagram or Twitter that they want to see him in the ring, and he said he said battle who. 
bad niggas tag me in the shit or something like that, right? Is that what yeah. it was? You did that shit. One of my niggas jumped in, bad niggas, he'll smoke you. Babes. And then I jumped in the like, I said, I, 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 I said, I don't think there's a rapper in the industry that, that could fuck with me in the ring. Y'all niggas is different. I ain't fuck with none of y'all niggas. Y'all niggas is <laughs> professional respect. Fuck out of here. <laughs> a rapper? Nah. I was like, nah, that's it. And the mm-hmm. way the way my brain think, right, as uh-huh. a as a street nigga and an artist, I'm like, whether I work with you or work against you, your energy is still gonna propel me the same way. If you're my enemy or we're gonna trap together, it's the same momentum. So you choose, nigga, because I go any which way. I don't give a which fuck. Way, right. I'm still going this way, dissing you or working with you. True, right. So that's how I look at shit. I'm like, okay, I could go at you or work with you. It's the same shit. Some people do the same, do it um right. Do it one time. Um I heard I heard something that uh every every feature that Papoose did, he he disses. Person he's doing the feature. <laughs> niggas, niggas said, they, they said it about a couple niggas. <laughs> nah, it's just something I heard. <laughs> nah, but I, I, I heard it. I, I, I didn't say I, where I heard it from. I used to hear that about a lot of rappers. But it was it was a valid opinion. So I was mm. like, word. I a couple rappers was like that. I started listening. I, was I heard like, Jay was like that. A couple niggas I heard was oh, doing yeah. that. Yeah. <laughs> I never did that though. If I show, if I, if I it's show like love, it's always love. you do it because you just want to be better than the person. Nah, if you dissing nigga on the track with, I mean, not me. I I show love to nigga. Fuck with. I diss a bunch of niggas. I don't like subliminals. If I'm dissing, I'm fucking dissing. You. Yes. I don't do the middle ground shit. Right. Yeah. I like cause me I like to give that's my personality, one, but two, I like to give niggas what I wanna see. If you dissing somebody, I don't want to hear no subliminal shit. Like, who the fuck you talking about? Say yes, say real shit. Name. Yeah, I, I like it me as a fan of shit. Word I can't fuck with early. fuck that subliminal shit. But I'm you know who I think was always so good at that and I loved it, Jay. Jay-Z, yeah. That nigga's a genius and he's smooth with it. Make you out here. I'm not smooth. Trying I'm trying to decipher man. this shit. Like, <laughs> who you talking about? Because it's like, it's more powerful for me when Jay does it, a subliminal. Because it's almost Only like... Only Jay, though, because he's like Jay. Yeah. Not, it's almost like, you're not I got some Jay stories I'm going to tell you off camera, too. Like, okay. If I say camera? your name, your worth doubles. Yeah. But this I ain't going to say your name. So now, I like that shit. You know what I mean? I ain't saying bitch's name no more. I'm about a dollar. Who the fuck is 50 cents? That was like a that was for 50. That was like that was clear. It's kind of like clear. perfect example. Like I never had a beep of 50, right? Right. But if he ever said my name in a foul way or made fun of me or whatever the fuck, I might just be like, thank you, nigga. Because <laughs> so, all your fans, I'm gonna go crazy yeah. on you. But yeah. I'm gonna go crazy on you for your fans. Yeah. Right. You never heard of me. Right. So it's throwing me the crazy alley oop. I'm gonna catch that shit. That's right. Yeah, but that's why it's I, good. But to that's how he thinks too. As a huge artist, like because a, it's like, why would I? So I thank Jay Z for that line. If you if you say my name, I imagine like if Fifty posted me crazy or said it, like no matter, wh- no matter what, what you say, right. it's gonna make your fans be like, who that? Who that? Right. Right. I'm gonna take that who layer of like, who I'm going crazy. I'm like, they all looking at me right yes. now. Yes, <laughs> I'm that's going crazy. I think that's why I hope was over subliminal because yes. he was mindful of what type of attention he would draw to certain Absolutely. people. So if you knew, you knew. It was a hot round. When you were that successful. You like a mini genius. 50, Puff, Jay, them niggas mm-hmm. is far from stupid. You yeah, don't right. get that successful winging it. Yeah. Right. Them niggas know their power. Please say believe it. You know what I'm saying? Song if he say your name, a million dollars. it's beyond Disney. Unless he think you dead already, he don't give a fuck. But if he, if he, <laughs> if you want to, if you on the same level as him, they probably don't care. But if you down here, like if I'm here trying to climb up, he's here. He's not doing you. That's a life raft. Buddy. Basically. Like, yeah, but, but he didn't even do that with people that was like, like, we know he did Prodigy. We know he did Rest in Peace. We know he did small beat, small nah, beat. He just but he never said their names. Yeah. But after the after the deal, um, what no. you call it? In, on on um R O C. We running this rap. Take my J. I'm the right. Oh, he he definitely did. We know he said their name. Right, right, right. But he didn't but say their name. But Jay invented that shit. He invented that slick talk of yeah. shit. Yeah. Who the fuck was doing that before that? He invented that I think shit. He was. He's just the greatest at it. Who was that nigga's a, a genius with it. And Drake, I think, took a page out of his book. Super. He, Drake is he's, great he's with that, subliminal shit. Oh yeah. But his subliminals be like. Crap down a block. <laughs> Made a Made right. right. <laughs> it's on sight. Like that whole scheme is fire. Hold on. Hold on. Checks over strikes. What are you talking about, Kanye? When we heard about um, Puff snuffing Drake. Oh yeah, that was crazy. I got out. Everybody the public. was like, "Was that real?" Yeah, that was, was that out. Did that happen? That happened? That happened? I know that was. I know that was public. Oh, okay. That was yeah, not public. Well, we don't know. From what I heard, we he don't physically know put hands on. What? If it's actually real, so it's a legend. 
Yo, it's fuck allegedly. that shit. Pump a gangster on the low. But yeah. who we going for? But what kind of solidified is for you? Pump check you. I know, no, I know. But what solidified is for you? You can't be that rich and be pussy. It's Drake not a... Kenny, you bugging. It's mad them niggas is pussy as shit. I'm saying, pump your head shit, though. Yeah, he'll probably pay that money on shit. If I was that rich, I'll put 80 grand on your head. Shut up. Well, fuck it, talk to me. He put a million on somebody with Keefe D, remember? Keefe D said he put... This is on Black TV, man. Keefe D went on Black TV. Listen, man, he went on Vlad TV. He went on Vlad TV, my nigga. Made it public and said, yo, puff off a niggas a million dollars. Who? Who's that at? Keefe D, the one who supposedly said his his nephew killed Tupac. He said that? He said that. He said said his nephew was the one. He said it to the feds. This shit is out. What? I, I he said, know, wow. he I said know, Orlando. Because I, I know that Vlad pays people for Regardless if he paid it. Depending on what he didn't tell Vlad this. He wow. actually said it uh, like while he was getting, like while the cops had him in a the room. They recorded him. He said, yeah, yeah yo. He came by right? around, pop, shot him, all that. I he, saw that. He said but everything. I that was bullshit. What's the nigga name? Yeah. Uh, Keefe D, which was Orlando. Uh, the dude, that. Tupac punched in the, what you call it? Yeah. He said this shit was all gang shit. He said he punched him. He won the heady with Pac. Niggas wasn't. So he's, they came back around, they get shot up the car, they kept it pushing. He talked so, about the whole so shit. With the Puff, I ain't Puff, I ain't no, before that, Puff was already beefing with them niggas. And he was cool with one of Puff's mans. And Puff said, I'll put a million up, whoever take care of the situation type shit. Nice. And niggas was like, niggas was like, niggas was like, word? Type shit, and then that happened around that time. So that's why they always link Puffy. So let's go. So, so, my nigga, no, 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 Uncle Murder said, "Yo, this nigga Puffy, I'm not fucking with Puff because he already no, killed. No, he got no, pot no, killed." So before you say that, answer the question. So I'm nigga, saying this is all public. The, the, the views and opinions of knowledge <laughs> <laughs> do not. These ain't my opinions. Show. My views. They are his own. <laughs> These are facts. You can look up. <laughs> I know nothing about this. Never heard it before. You never heard of none <laughs> no, of this shit? No, no, no. I you haven't. know what's crazy, though? That's crazy. I never heard it before either, but if that's true, then them niggas had a million dollar offer and killed the nigga for free? Yeah, basically. That's what he said. Because he said he never got the bread. God damn. He said Puffy never that's paid him. That's a rip off? And he <laughs> said, <laughs> <"Man>, fuck it. <laughs> you ripped this up for? That's crazy. <laughs> yeah. I never heard you know, that, though. I'm dead. I'm that, um, I never heard nah, that. Nah, shit. I'm not saying it's Nah, nah, I'm go online. Nah, nah, go online. It's out there. Nah, but the fact that he's saying it's out there. <laughs> don't, 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 don't do me don't like do that. Don't do that. We're going to edit this. We're not really going to edit it, but you know. But the fact that, that, that they're saying that it's everywhere and they're not doing anything, yeah. then what does that mean? Yo, police don't find nobody with a rap I'm just saying, because I said Puffy's a gangster, and I was just adding that on to show how gangster he is. Think about it. Like, you rap and you get <laughs> shot, you, you, there's a killer, the killer's got free. You ain't on it. You're going to be on that shit. Police ain't solving no rap murders, nigga. I'm just going to be That's real. Rest in peace, Nipsey. Nobody going to help Nipsey. Absolutely. Yeah. Oh, man. I still have my own conspiracy theories about yeah, that. Yeah, though, we ain't gonna get into that shit. You know what I mean? Word. But, rest but in general, J, rest in, in, peace in, to him. in general, though, how many rappers die by gun violence and, and they never saw police them. don't do a motherfucker? That's real. Thing? That's real talk. About he rapped, just put a I'm, fucking... I'm sure the statistics is retarded on that. Just think about it. Think of all the rappers that, that, that fell victim to the hammer and who went to jail for it. Unsolved. Most of them shits. Word. Not all of them. At least the ones we. The, mic, the the magnifying glasses on, the ones that I see on. Most of them. I don't really see I think nothing. Chris Rock or Dave, uh, Dave Chappelle said if you want to kill anybody and get away with it, just put a mixtape in his pocket. <laughs> That's a fact. <laughs> yeah. 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 Just put I'm a mixtape in his nigga pocket. Yeah. 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 Oh, he's a get away I'm with it. Clean. Yeah. Yeah. Says a rapper? <laughs> Open the shut case. Yeah. 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 drug related. Yeah. 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 Sprinkle a little cocaine. Okay, let, let me ask you this. Oh, let me ask you this. What's, the, <laughs> yeah. what's the specific reason? If, if you if you can just lay out a specific reason to why you think that happens, what would it be? A rapper's or un, but the murders are unsolved for rappers? Correct. I don't know. What's your opinion? I didn't even thought about that. I don't even know, to be honest. I mean, Fox be black and they don't really give a fuck. Okay. My Kanye Rich. shit, old Kanye shit. But um but I don't know. I don't know if it's I don't know if I people don't know probably if don't cooperate. Is, that is if, Nah, they snitches everywhere, man. I don't be really believing that shit. Snitches yeah. come home and do well. Snitches prosper in this motherfucker. I don't <laughs> nah, know if we you just noticed. About that. A snitch come home and got a bag. A bunch of niggas fucking talking about, he ain't tell on me. Happens all the time. 
Yeah. Niggas do well. I tweeted about this the other day, and niggas like, oh, you wildin'. Nigga, I've seen it a million times. I've, I've seen, seen regular niggas bag, snitch on niggas the hood. On his dick. Or, you know how I many snitch niggas that with straight paperwork is in this industry right now? I'm not gonna blow niggas up on camera unless I have yeah, a real reason yeah. to. <laughs> but, but, but I've seen no, paperwork. No, 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 Cause big homie, that's crazy. Chaz had paperwork like this high on everybody that did something or said something, wow. boy. Everybody filed from my knee to the fuck. I'm not even joking. Crazy. Paper, you can touch it and read it and see what the fuck he said. Niggas yeah, told, bro. So it's more niggas snitching yeah. than, and than, than what they know. But, but bro, be people. I can blow a couple niggas up. I'm not going to. That's a street yeah. issue, so I'm yeah. not going to. This is entertainment. I, 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 got, a, a I got a situation niggas. where Come on, two son. rappers I knew, who with they peoples, I be on this side, they be like, don't mess with that guy. Mm -hmm. I be on that side, they be like, don't mess with that guy. Right. One day, one of them pulled out the paperwork, and I was like, ah, let me take a picture of this real quick. <laughs> <laughs> Click. And then I went to my man's on the other side, and I was like, yo, what's this about? Damn, that's crazy. They was like, uh. So they stopped fucking with me. Wow. Said, Matt, do research on me? They was like, I thought we were friends. They said, Matt, no, Matt, no, Matt, no. You approached the guy that the paste purple was? No, I took it to his homies that was telling me not to fuck with the other side. Oh, okay, okay, okay. And I was like, but what about this? Right. And they was like, wow, about that. The emotion. Well, my phone stopped ringing as frequently as it was That's crazy, because when I ask questions like that, niggas just, they just explain it. They be, I'm not even going to blow niggas' names up, but niggas just give me a long explanation. I'm like, you got to explain it to the streets. I ain't the judge, the street mm. judge, nigga. You ain't got to explain nothing to me. Right. I'm going to choose not to fuck with you because that's how I was raised. You got to explain it to the rest of these niggas that may or may not know. I who we want the exclusive who? No, I can't do that. <laughs> no, on camera, I can tell you, but this is entertainment. I can't do that. Get fed. We but you'd be surprised. Like, <laughs> people just be scared of jail, man. Like, they just everybody they, got their reason. Yo, I've man. seen people really? snitch before they even get to the precincts. Like, <laughs> yo, just give me a like, cheeseburger, some chips. Up, man. Yo, like, eat, come they here. They gonna eat that cheese. They gonna take the cheese yeah. right out the burger. Right. Yeah. I'm, I'm vegan. I'm gonna take this cheese though. <laughs> it happened. It's like uh, first forty eight. Like, you see that all the time? Let's be like, yo, all right, yo. That's where you get to see niggas snitching yeah. live, like yo. But see, but look, that's more propaganda. Think about how niggas probably don't tell. They probably we're not gonna air that. Yeah, right. that's, that's real. real. That's, that's real. real. Yeah. Yeah. They, they need, they need you to see your own yeah. snitching. Why don't they ever put the real niggas? That's like, <laughs> nah, nah, give me my lawyer. Eat a dick. It ain't Fuck it ain't, that. Yeah, yeah. No, they yeah. don't yeah. never put the niggas out. Yeah, where they at? First forty eight. Where the niggas at? Where the we don't bet. But, but I think mean, that's part of it. Like, they want everybody to believe Probably that. I believe that. No I mean, that's one of the show, though. You I believe that. People yeah, because you know, if you don't cooperate, you know, then they didn't you know, win. Then why air it? Right. We lost this episode. Right. We're not airing that. Right. I'd like to see at least one episode where niggas like, all right. Nigga, keep it told. I ain't snitching, oh, my nigga. Oh, yo, yo, lock me up, um, whatever. Talking about, man. And, and, and yo, also, that's all. Y'all charging me with something. Yeah. <laughs> and that's you get also, more cheeseburger, <laughs> Donald shit, but, nigga. Um, the narrative they want to push to, to, to encourage people to snitch. Like, hey, if Top you again. snitch, you get off. That just, that's all they everybody showing knows us. snitching equals a get out of jail free card. Mm -hmm. So now every time somebody. Not everybody. It, I mean, the average human being right. will feel like, oh, if I snitch, I'll get away with everything, right? But if you're true to the street, of course, you're going to stand by your word. Me specifically, I won't do shit that I feel like I can't do the time for. I said the same So shit. I feel like, hmm, I can't do 30 years, I ain't going to do that. You know what I'm saying? Right. Like, I could do a year and a half. I'm going to do, do this. That. <laughs> <laughs> I do that shit That's on real my shit, head, though. I saw Franco, too. Some people can't, but, even, can't even do that. No, you got you to gotta, you gotta be responsible. I know somebody here through seven years, one of my mans, who was all kind of involved in something. The plan didn't go the way it was. I told him to fall back. I'm going stick, to stick around and check things out. They got pulled over. Um, the dude told the other guy, yo, give me the hammer. He put it in his armrest. Retarded. Cops tossed the car. Damn. Found a joint. One dude was an ex-felon. One dude had a clean record. At the time, it wasn't the mandatory three and a half. He got like probation or six months. Mm -hmm. And he threw seven years on the other dude. Damn. Wait, the other, seven wait, years. whose gun was it? I'm not the, sure. The but yeah, it was the fella. <laughs> no, no, no. It was the fella. <laughs> I'm not saying but same the fella was like, bust the corner, I'm going to run. And he said, nah. Give it to me. Oh, uh, and, and still, the arm still was like, that's Now, when crazy. I heard the story, I was like, so you sat there while he put it in the arm. Shouldn't have buggy, yeah. Yeah, I would have been like, nigga, you stupid. 
You yeah. just go. Yeah. You know what yeah. I mean? Yeah. You bust the corner fast enough to, hey, nobody see that. Yeah. yeah. Like, right. By the time the cops do all that extra shit, they ain't finding right. nothing. You know what I right. mean? Right. Okay, yeah. cool. But Slap on the wrist. To, to, to get out of that six months or five years prob- probation, that nigga said, he fuck put that. seven years. Yeah. Well, I'll do it. But wait, time out. That's crazy. Do you think he's is that but it wasn't his gun. Is that snitching, though, man? Yeah, is that because it wasn't his gun? This is a dude that um when I battled Abram, yeah. second round, I talked about the situation. Okay. He turned around and made a diss record about me, and had his gang members in my phone like, "Why are you saying that about?" And I'm like, "Yo, because it's real. <laughs> like, you don't know this. You don't know who you hanging with, do you? It's crazy. Mm-hmm. But like, <laughs> some people just scared of jail, son. They just." I'm telling you, I've, I've literally seen people in the precinct saying it wasn't me, it was him. I'm like, wow. You you know when you are um, like a Raymond, right? Some for some bullshit, and then you see everybody else's case, like straight up, like yo, it wasn't mm-hmm. mine, it was it. Like nobody's asking you that, bro. Right. All you ask is like yo, yo, in, in third grade, right? This is not a court right now. <laughs> it's not, it's not <laughs> like, it's like bro, this is not your case. This is not your. This is not it. <laughs> Crazy. And I'm appalled, like, damn. Wow, it's crazy. I don't, I don't know who's who until it goes down. Fact. So now, like, so now it's crazy. Now it's, uh, yeah, it's a question all day. Just answer it. Is snitching ever acceptable? Is it ever okay? To snitch? No. To snitch? Now, hold, on, hold, on, hold, on, hold on. If you go Let's for the definition of snitching, first. exactly. Yeah, that's, that's, what that's, that's what I'm saying. Right. Is it, is it Sorry, snitching? nigga, I'm is trying to come home. No. If you wilding out in my mom's hallway, she look out. And see all types of illegal activities and she call the cops on you. She's not snitching. Not snitching. So she's not involved can't snitch. in your she's criminal activity, right. But she's conducting a criminal activity outside of the door. A nigga still be like, she's snitching on me. She's not snitching. The nigga that got locked up gonna be like, she the one that snitched on me. Nah, that's not snitching. You should have helped her with a grocery, right? You know what I mean? I should have taken care of that. It's a fine line. So I'm gonna see where everybody's standing. Now, that's what I'm saying. And me and you, do a crime. We're going to go through yeah. this. Or we got business together. Right. You get bagged, but they want something bigger than what you did, and you offer me up. Yeah, that's fair. That's How about your that's homie, though? Snitching yeah. is selfish because you are living the same life of crime that the nigga you telling on. Anything else, you're just a pedestrian. If you didn't yeah. choose this life and make that decision to do whatever, yeah. Yeah. Right. it has nothing to do with you. So, so what, is it what, up, between what about your boy? What about your yeah, boy? If you're a civilian but, and you just tell, that's not snitching to me. But it's such a fine line. That's you're, what I'm saying. You're, you're, you're doing people criminal get away activity. With shit. Like, my cousin got stabbed in front of me. I knew who did it. I went to their block, ran up on them. Police ran up on me. Guns out. <clears throat> I never told them, them niggas stabbed my cousin. Mm-hmm. That technically wasn't snitching. But for me, I mean, of course, I, I wanted them to be free. So when I get out, nigga, I'm going to find you again. You know what I mean? But but that's technically not snitching. You think what I'm saying? Right, I feel you. So, time out. Yeah, yeah. So, like, yeah, so, okay, cool. So if... I agree with that. So if somebody does something to your family and you don't know them and you tell the cops that's not snitching, that's a good point. Question. What kind of lifestyle are you living? That's a part of it, too. So it's all about lifestyle. It's all about lifestyle. It's not a part of lifestyle. It's not snitching. Because it's kind of like... In a way. I mean, it's how... It's still telling, man. But it's not crazy. If somebody breaking your crib and you got to do a police report, you're going to be like, I ain't seen nothing. That nigga broke in your crib. What was the most famous thing when Cam Brown went on TV? You know what I'm saying? 60 seconds, I mean, 60 minutes or whatever. That was ridiculous. And they said, you got a serial killer. That nigga said, I ain't saying nothing. I'd rather move. What? When Cam Brown, they was like, yo, he went on 60 minutes. And he was like, yo, so you wouldn't tell on somebody if they were a serial killer and they were killing everybody? He said, I'd move. I ain't snitching on that nigga. That nigga ain't got nothing to do with me. You said I'm you just don't mind my business. So, so is it like, yeah. a, like I don't say nothing because your man, you said, oh, uh, the c- scenario you said, homie grabbed the hammer and all that. Right. Is he a snitch? Yeah. Yeah. He's a snitch because he was involved in the criminal activity. Even though it that, had really nothing to do with him. He tried to help me out, but then he got caught up and he right. said, yo, my nigga, I can't take this. I feel like the right. only situation. Nigga, this is I, your shit. I tried to help. See the, see the so he was supposed to take that time. The was, let me out your car and I will remove. And yeah, that's what he that should have done. When, when, no. when, when you decide to take the gun, you involve no, yourself. No, no, no. 100%. Then you want to turn around and I got do that you. Now. I got you. 
Wrong place, wrong time. But that means you're not committing a crime. If you if you are innocent bystander, you're not in the act of some criminal activity, then, then you then you a civilian in that. So situation. you witness a murder, yeah. and you see the person who did it. How about this? Nah, you ain't saying nothing to the cops, so you're gonna say, yo, nah, it was nah, like I seen the dude. It was this right? person. Say like this situation, right? Say like uh me and Math is in the car. And Don't make I, me the snitch. Come on, son. No. Don't do that. You did some shit last week. Yeah. And he was like, then I can't trust you, man. No. I was like, well, damn, why got to be an example? Me and knowledge is in the car. Come on, son. Me and knowledge is in the car. I'm a snitch. Oh, my God. Me and knowledge is in the car. Or me and person X is in the car. Right. 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 Person X is in the car. Right. And they have a gun. And the cops come. I'm unaware of the gun. They put it under my seat. The cops pulled me over. Oh, no, you now, know. I have a gun under my seat. I know it ain't mine. If I say, yo, this is not my gun, it's his, that I happened snitch. To me. You could say it's not that your gun. That exact scenario happened to me. It's not yours. You could say it's not your gun. You it's can't not, say that's it's your property, though. So not, either way, you're uh, going uh, who down. Who is person X to you? <laughs> yo, <laughs> what are you doing? Are you transporting? No, no. Are you robbing just, your just, enemies? You're just what riding with your friend. But like, keep it, keep it, that happened to me. That exact scenario. That exact scenario happened to me in real life. A couple of years ago, I was riding with a homie. Because he might don't, because I know. I know. I know two people. And person X don't take it. Yo, I know two Stop people that this happened to. Then I'm going to use it on And I was confused. Nah, son. <laughs> yeah. You're not, not going to do that. I remember that because I was riding. riding. Right. If you don't take it, that's grinding. Right. So, so it's okay was, for you to say it's his <laughs> shit because I got two friends happening. Nah. It just happened. It's still and, not okay. And, and, and two of them got locked up because one of them said, ooh, that's not mine. And then he said, I don't know who's his daddy. Like, he threw the gun in the car. Nah, that's that's and then he said, That's a punk ass shit, though. It is fast. But right. my man, the driver, did the right. time. Did the time? That's a real nigga right there, boy. And I, I mean, I don't even mean to say real nigga like that, but it's like, that's OD. Because that happened, the same exact shit happened to me. I was coming from out of town with my man. He didn't tell me he had a gun in the car. I got pulled over. I'm like, nigga, we good. Don't worry. Okay. We just got weed. We straight. You know, he don't say nothing. The cops tell me, get out. They said, book him. I said, first time I ever getting locked up in my life. Nigga, put the cuffs on me. Tell the cops, yo, that nigga's bugging, yo. Right, for so what? what, they found a the gun in the car? Did they show you the gun? Not initially. So I'm in the back of the cop car. I'm like, yo, so y'all niggas could legally uh, kidnap me. Cause I don't know if y'all niggas cops. They ain't show me no badge. I ain't like, yo, right. what y'all doing? Then they say, you must not know. I said, nah, I don't know what y'all talking about. And then they said, we found a gun in your car. And I then said, what? Oh, and this nigga so didn't tell, tell me nothing. They you the perfect person. To and what did tell you do? Me. Did you snitch? Uh, well, you know, I went through the whole system. Had to go to court. Had to fucking go through the whole shit. But he eventually, you know what I mean, had to say it was his. But it was like, yo, I still had to go through six, three, four months. They took my car. All types took all my but, but phone, took all did, my did shit. Did you ever have to threaten him and be like, nah? Because I told him when we got the cell after the shit, I said, yo, my nigga. I love you. <laughs> I'm not even gonna say I'm bad. First time you're locked yeah. up, but yo, my nigga, just do the right thing. Cause, right. Cause you got in my car and didn't even tell me. You ain't yeah, tell me, yeah. my nigga. You didn't even get yeah. so yeah. It's yeah. like it's like at this up, point, like, we get pulled. at this yeah. point, we we men like my nigga, just handle your situation. I'm not even gonna bitch. I know what I'm gonna have to go through. All right, cool. Right. But nigga, like, let's, let's turn go up. but I still had to go to court, sit let, in front let, of them. They had to ask me questions. And I had to be like, yo, I didn't know, I don't know nothing. I don't even know if there was a gun in the car. Knowledge. I don't know if the cops are still lying. Put it in that's what I was talk. saying to them people. I, I right. But I'm like, yo, this shit crazy. Because yeah. that's what we do. Because when you get put in that, spicy. I see, it's a different type of thing. Because so I felt like, yo, son, they really could have niggas fucked up out here. Because this is my first time ever in court. Then I'm like, yo, I could probably say the wrong thing, and they'll lock me up for something I ain't even do. So my so mind is like, yo, I don't even want to be up here talking to y'all niggas. But it was right. like, this is the process. Yeah, that, that's how I know. That's you know what I'm saying? That was that's like, my boy. That's my boy. I He's bet. still friends to this day. Got so. him. Check. Now, <laughs> you said it was your first time getting locked up. Ever in my life. All right. Now, what if that man Only time, had two too. strikes on him, third strike, he going yeah. down for life? That would you have been... taken it down for him? Nah, I'm not trying to take that for All what? Right. Like, so I got family. I'm like, yo, my nigga, take earlier. your shit. Period. Mm -hmm. Why do I have like, to sit here? So does that make me a snitch? That is the question. Do that make me a snitch if I be like... No, but no, that's different because... Knowledge had no idea. Mm -hmm. This dude took But still, it. do I still take the charge and be, or do I say, yo? Because all I said, I never nah, said. I don't believe you I just straight up said, I don't, I don't believe know nothing about no gun. Just for the I fact that he got take in the, the car, didn't tell how much you right. Nah, I don't believe you. Because you might not, you might not have turned the corner so fast. You might not have yeah. ran yeah. And you know what's funny? the gas on you know the yellow. Funny? You know what I mean? His gun was in my trunk, and since I was dropping him off, I took it and put it in the back seat. 
But I didn't know. I thought it was his bag. So I'm looking at my... I'm like, let me put this shit right here. So I didn't even know that... You know what I'm saying? So I'm like, nigga, if you would have told me, I would have left it in the trunk or whatever. Hide it better. Put it in the engine or something, my nigga. Like, right. you know what I'm saying? Something. Right. Like, come on. Now, now originally, this whole snitching thing was kind of like a code amongst gangs. Right. It wasn't about civilians. At all. That's, not, that's the only thing I'd be saying. Right. Like, yo, you part of this gang, this group. My culture, no We're doing illegal activity. You eating, I'm eating. Mm -hmm. If you getting the problems, don't say nothing. Yeah, you got to hold it down. Take care of us, and we'll take care of Real you. Real shit. Yes. Right. That don't really blood happen blood nowadays out. too much. You know what I'm saying? And the gangs were su originally supposed to be protecting the neighborhoods. Mm -hmm. Shit is all fucked up right and, now. And just for gangs, I think it's more a mafia thing. Because I feel like that's kind of like more... Because I feel like blacks are a lot Ma adopted. Is, no, I'm just saying, regardless yeah. if you want to call it a gang, whatever. But I feel like, you know, that's kind of where I feel like a lot of that shit kind of started. Because I feel like I blacks that, that, adopted nah, some me, of that. Unless me, I'm wrong. You know what I mean? Yeah, kind of. Because remember, the, the niggas I was raised by, they the same age as the gang niggas that you probably... Okay. The, Fucking Italian mobs, which is black niggas with the same type of power, it's just not okay. on TV as much. Right. So they didn't invent that shit. It just looked like that on TV. Okay, but, okay, um, okay. Right. Not a rule, no, the rules. I, the same I think shit. on some level, like the mafia does hold a little more weight, only because it's like, uh, as as far as I know, like when I I know people from the mafia, if they make a threat, it happens. I've seen gang members make threats, and it ain't nothing happening. So I'm nah, not talking but, but, about on, on every game. It's, it, it's not the same. But man. I think you mafia... Think like mafia is, I don't think it's like that. I don't that know about now. now. I don't no, I don't about now. You got TV shows, Growing Up Gotti and all that I'm stuff. But I'm not growing up. I know. Even with the gang shit. Even with the gang shit, if certain niggas make a threat, it's going to happen. You probably talking about the niggas just running around with flags and shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This certain niggas make a threat. Oh, you got a problem. Right, but that's why I said, like, when I was growing up, like, I didn't know about that. 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 Like, I didn't know about Stop that. Yo, it's gonna happen. To stop, yeah. right. Games you know used saying? to be more like a family, and I just feel like now it's just more like, oh, I just want to like belong to something. Yeah. For me, when I, I when I first like started yeah. seeing people turning blood, crip in New York, at first it was a lot of the soft niggas trying to rally together. Right. Then my man's would get locked up, and they'll come home flagging. Because <laughs> on the inside, yeah, they dominated the jail. You gotta join something. You know what I'm saying? So, no, you don't have to join something. You don't have to. I mean, you to. become a bigger force. Or you, like, you either like you join this sure group safe, and man. not if get you're your not ass beat. Or you don't. <laughs> <Yeah. dumb. laughs> you blood, you crip. You know what I'm saying? Like, I never was oh, cool with any type of gang. I never wanted to join nothing. Because I felt like it it bring you more. You got three what? Three state did. It bring okay. you more. Never it bring you more. Um, right. But, and, but that's not that's not everybody. Isn't it in jail? You know like none of that street shit really matters in jail. Cause I never did a huge bit. I know. So I'm asking. Don't all that shit out the window like blood crip. All that's out the window. It's more like. You got niggas who was pussy in the streets. Yeah. Go to jail and be tough. Really? You got niggas who was tough in the street. Go to jail and be, be pussy. pussy. And you got niggas who just always did just the same. Right. Like that shit don't mean that shit don't mean nothing. It's a different ball game there, but that shit that shit I don't know. I just never had to put the, 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 the need or want to join anything. Right. I was good, Gucci anywhere. Right. And I got along with everybody. It didn't matter. I mean, I don't, I don't know. I'm just a different nigga, I guess. Right. No, I mean, I never thought the gang thing was cool because I thought it'd bring more problems than than anything. Cause like now, because I'm blood or crip, now I got a, a billion more enemies that I never even knew about because now you just got a problem with the gang. For me, right. it's like, hey, I'd rather just be dolo, my own, Man, my sure. own gang, murder right. F gang is as far as I got <laughs> in the game. The music made that shit glorified. Yep. Shit like yes. That. In the East Coast. Yes. Now, 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 East Coast. All around the, the country. No, no, no. All around the country, to be honest. Yeah, because the, 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 the music, the music, yeah, around the world. There's Bloods and Crips in Poland. Word, but, but I, 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 because of the music, Poland, though, there's Bloods <laughs> and Crips, bro. So let me because ask, of the music, bro. I'm telling let you, let me ask you this. the music, we glo they, they, the gang shit glorified. Think about it. They, they make it look so cool. Yeah. Imagine you 15 Facts. watching Facts. the shit. shit. See Lil Wayne with the, the rap band, 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 band,
Crip walking. You got to bow out, crip walking. I feel my son and my that. nephew throwing up gang signs in the picture. I was like, what y'all looks doing? Cool. They, it looks cool. It cool to them. <clears throat> right. That's what I'm trying to say. Think about it. Bow out was crip walking. It looked great. Right. Yeah. What the fuck is that? Yeah. Think about it. Real shit. He's just throwing it. Exactly. But it looks fantastic. You know what I'm saying? But you're like, what the fuck is that? That shit crazy. My daughter posted pictures all over those Snapchat, the thriller thing. Dancing. Next video, she throwing signs. Coming out like this. They don't even know what it means, but it looked great. What the fuck are you doing? Like, wow, you bugging out. I had to it was crazy. Right. What, what, what you thought? What you thought about Rolling Loud? You don't really know. Don't do that. Don't do that. What you thought about? What you thought about Rolling Loud shutting down like the Casanovas and all these dudes that supposedly affiliated with gang banging from um, the shows? Like where it actually started affecting niggas' money? I don't blame. Wait, what you mean? You can't blame. Because they basically a lot of a lot of them got shut down from no, coming no, no, no. to the tour because they're supposedly gang bad. affiliated. No, no. So they're saying if you Rolling, flagging or you promoting the gang. Rolling Loud didn't shut down anybody. The okay. fucking police shut them down. Oh, the police shut them down. They, they, they threatened Rolling okay. Loud, so y'all put okay. the niggas on it, we shut you down. Okay, 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 okay. okay. So, so now the music. I mean, that's whack. The music they using that against the artists now. But that's from the beginning of the time, beginning of hip hop. We went through a bunch of shit talking to gangsta shit. You, yeah, you know how shit in my lyrics I had to edit out? Because mm. I know police. Niggas don't understand. The hip hop police is real. Yeah. Okay. Yes. They black niggas that like rap too. Right? Yeah. Whatever the fuck. They and know, they listen all. When, I, when I'm outside going to the club, I say hi all of them. They know all my shit. They know right. all your shit. They right. know the music, yeah. my nigga. They know, know who's who. Like, you I know. I seen a cop in the corner. Yo, real yes, shit. Yeah. No, yeah. no. Nigga, they be like, yo, I see the hip hop police. Like, she don't do it. When R3 coming out, they know everything. I had that on. You know what I'm saying? I had that issue for a little while. I got into something across town. One of my mans got killed with certain people involved. And um, the detectives found out who I was. We were celebrating. I had to add in the source. And from then on, certain people I knew on the island that knew me were getting pulled off. And they was asking about me. And I was like, oh, shit, this shit real. Like, these niggas, like, I'm, I'll chill. I'm, I'll, be, I'll be chilling. Like, I'm not even on that time. But they, there was that. Curious, like, okay, he, he rap out that, that, that. They was putting in their work. The, just the fact that they're called the hip hop police, to me, is kind of ridiculous. But I understand because hip hop got to a point where it just associated itself with a lot of criminal mm-hmm. shit. Yeah. Right. Like predominant. I mean, a lot of people have statements rap, in their rap, like, 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 This is like, 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 and because, my man's be shooting people every day. I'm about to say that. Because really? hip-hop is based in reality, right. mm-hmm. yeah. niggas be telling on themselves in the yeah. records. Right. Yeah. That's why you got to... Yeah. I always watch what I real say shit. in the records. Because right. yeah. you can't say real shit with real names no. in it. Mm-hmm. I think about it. Like that Bobby Spurner record. Yeah. They went in. They live in and look... Yeah, that was crazy. Yeah. Yeah. They look for the yeah. niggas. Like, and they was like, oh, he's, he's the one. Then, where we go? Now, Chewy, he's a hot nigga? Chewy. Who's Chewy? He's a we could go. Who caught a body about a week ago? like, yo, today's Tuesday. That's what <laughs> did So we could go. Let's just look at Do you think Battle Rap got hip hop police? A couple uh, people died. Battle Rap. Is it too small to have hip hop police? Battle Rap is fucking um, huge, nigga. That's yeah, nothing small about that I'm shit. That's yo, the same police. There's only one. Okay, okay. okay. No, I, I just had to ask. I was Absolutely. on the corner, right? Absolutely. These girls was fighting. These girls were getting it popping on the corner. Whatever. Long story short, the cop come and spray the girl. So I'm like, yo, you ain't had to do that shit, my nigga. Is she a girl? You could have just grabbed her and removed her from the situation. We had to spray. He like, yo, misfit. <laughs> I ain't gonna watch your battles no more. I'm like, yo, first That's of all, let know. me get out of here. Right. Second of all, <laughs> this is crazy. Yeah. I'm about to talk bad shit to this nigga. Like, he said, he you know me. Bitch ass like, cop. Oh. Like. <laughs> You was like, oh, I'm hot. I'm out here. Like, get out. Like, I'm out here. Oh, yeah. yeah. Do your job, bro. Like, I'm sorry. Follow my Instagram. <laughs> nah. How do you put like, that face on? You can't even call me misfit in front of my friends. That's crazy, though. <laughs> I'm like, so they, but it happened. They watch. So they watching all these bars. They been just talking crazy. crazy. When I first started, Boy. like, doing stuff. Yeah. I shot a video on Empire and Schenectady. I had, like, 70 dudes out there for a record called Stick Em. It's on um, YouTube. Famous Cops closet. came through to shut it down. Five cars. Everybody dispersed and they like, yo, math. Yo, math. <laughs> I'm like, I woke up. It's like, yeah, we watched the smacks and all that. 
<laughs> Tell your people to so keep it down. <laughs> You'll be out here for like what? I'll be like another 30 minutes. She's like, all right, cool. You, you got it. Just finish your Do video. Do your thing. Over the so they like, oh, regular yeah. people, yeah, bro. Regular people yeah. Enjoy the, the music on top of that. Right. So they, they, they probably would be listening to your shit if they wasn't police right. anyway. Right. So the fact that they got, they probably hired the niggas that listen to That's rap. Scary, like, make hip hop police. So they they all, know everything, they boy. They also delegate. They got people delegate, they delegate people to, to just sit there and just watch online shit. All Absolutely. Day. All day. Right. They know everything, boy. Like these guys are beefing. It might be drama at this event. Let's go. Because of the music, one time they tried to subpoena. Black camp to come in there for some music. Wow. That's banging on niggas like what? Banging on niggas. A peanut what? Wow. Where's that? Flick. They wanted to come in there and search hard drives and all kind of shit. That's niggas, crazy. He, banging on niggas, like, the he thought it was a joke. He was like, yeah, ha ha. Click. <laughs> They're gonna listen to the songs. I don't know what the fuck they trying to do. They was trying to come in there and go through music. And oh, it's the police. <laughs> That's crazy. Mama. He thought he thought it was a joke. I'm banging on them niggas like. <laughs> they called. He's like, wait, real? So what y'all think man. about the new era of guys' music? Potentially being played in indictments or courts and things like that, and people using your music, your lyrics, and what y'all saying, and battles or whatever, yeah. and niggas yes. using that yes. shit in court. Yes. That's they have been. It is a they, they, they using, it. Nigga, they using your music, Instagram, Twitter, all that. Nigga. Everything. They using everything. So anything yes. can be used against you in the court yes. of law. Nigga, they tricked yes. you into telling on yourself. Instagram, yes. Twitter. All this shit. But but they don't even have to trick people anymore because you see like violence. I mean a gentleman though. Yeah. They can't go to these platforms and allow you to run free and you tell People be on Instagram with guns Twitter? like, yeah, yeah, I'm getting it. What's I up? bet you are. <laughs> I can That's see the serial Nah, I've seen, I've seen, I've seen that. What are you doing? I've seen yeah, niggas you know, trying try to sell me. So I got the peas on deck on Facebook. Like, yeah. my nigga, you on Facebook. You know the feds on this shit? Is niggas still trapping in the comments? You the peas on deck? Is niggas still trapping in the comments? Yeah, yeah. No. yeah niggas still doing shit. I can make you a lot of money. Hit me up. Yeah, I got the peas in the comments. Come on, Keep with the shit, nigga. I block those people. Yo. When they be like, yo, Mav, you know, I know I know you official, da da da. Here's what I got. Or in a car in front of everybody. Here's what I've got, man. I'm good. Make you a lot Here's of money. I'm good. <laughs> You're hot. You're very Super hot. hot. But niggas be trapping in the comments, bro. Yeah, yeah. all day. Yeah. That's amazing. To the point now, they put their pictures up there. This is how the weed look. Yeah. And this is how the coke looks. Yes. And the crap. <laughs> they don't care about the weed. Yeah. Check my right. I know, I know. A while ago, you know, I was doing business with somebody. <laughs> and they made a comment about it. And oh, I stopped that's with crazy. It. I was like, me and Matt just wow. insane. Matt is a good oh, nigga, boy. Wow. He pay you in full. Chill. That's, that's insane. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> he took an L one out. <laughs> he took an L one out. He showed me three grams, man. Yeah. <laughs> Niggas Stop. is crazy. Sorry, pal. Um, I had another segue real quick. Um, as far as like music, right? I see like people with, like doing the streaming thing and everything like that. Is there still like money? In the music like that, because it feels like artists might just be out there putting themselves out there doing all that. But it seems like since you can't sell physical copies of your music, like it's streaming money, like streaming is passive good? income. It's, so, pa- it's, it's income though. You need you need it, it, millions something... of streams to make money. Millions. No, 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 no. no, no, no. no, 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 no I'm, 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 I'm gonna say, no, I'm gonna say, because I, I don't I don't get millions of streams and I get checks from the few music. It's not so I'm what, not a millionaire, what, what but right. What platform? Well, just two people alone. You need the millions. Oh, two so all that shit, yeah, no, you, you, you need YouTube? millions to make no, 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 no. decent checks. No, to make but big checks. Because I've had hundreds of thousands of different listeners. Different levels of how, yeah, how much they're going to pay me. If, you, pay. if, you, if you, not millions of dollars, but it's, it's money. It's like money, but it's not like, oh, I'm rich. Like, nah. Of course right. you need like You need the Drake level of shit to be paid. That's what I said. But you can pay some bills off that shit. It's hundreds, thousands at most. Yeah, you which is great. It's, it's not every great. Month. But think about it. If I'm getting that every month, I can't be mad. I'm getting a couple thousand a month. You can get that every month for doing that? Between, yeah. between, between, think between about it. all the shit, YouTube and Apple you and put out a project. Type, everything. There's more money in YouTube than streaming music. That's a fact. I make money. But think about this. You, no, there's not. Yes, it is. No, there's not. No, there's not. YouTube give you bread, bro. Yo, YouTube. You want to know what's happening right there. This is a good it, debate. Is it just no, me? No. Is it you just know, me? You know is everybody why? else in here? Because you know why YouTube, the algorithm is right? shit, is not how many Bro. views you get, it's how fast you get the views. But you don't, listen, YouTube is the only thing out there. So they do funny shit with everybody. Absolutely. I mean, I, I if, if you put out a video, YouTube is going to say, oh, that's not suitable. Correct. You could be petting a kitten. It's not suitable for advertising. But you could dispute right? it. You dispute so it. So you gotta dispute it. Yeah. But when you post it, all your subscribers are gonna be the ones that's gonna watch it first. Facts. Yes. Everything else, you gotta work, you gotta press, you gotta put up 
on your social media, yep, you gotta yep, retweet, yep, you gotta get other people times. to post it, yeah. it. But initially, most of your views are gonna come within that time yep. where they're trying to decide First 24, 30, if you're gonna 48 get top hours. dollar yep. or you're gonna get nothing. So you might drop your shit, get 30,000 views, then they say, okay, you know what? My bad, this shit was okay. You're good. <laughs> then you get like 2,000 more views. Nothing. No. Yeah. YouTube well, is well, no. I mean, I, no. I see what I see your point. Right. That that, that, that for me is like, oh, that should be. But YouTube has gotten <laughs> more <laughs> YouTube has gotten more strict since. Yeah, YouTube have definitely has gotten way more strict. Think about the content, though. People right? have no, but, but this is why I say music is better because let's say you drop a project, ten thousand people love that project. Just ten thousand. It's gonna pop up in a playlist. Streaming, They're gonna play it around friends. Not streaming. But if they it's streaming. It, yes. No. Yes. No. Streaming. Yo, streaming. Because I've had hundreds of thousands and made chump fucking change. Where did you post it? Everywhere. Spotify. iTunes. Now she got a point though. Apple Music. They got. They got. They got to buy that Everywhere. shit too. Everywhere. They have to buy it. When they buy it, that's when the big bucks. I think that's why. Yeah. I, I, when when you you make a lot. I, 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 I get most of people buying man. shit. Oh, okay. Okay. So you actually get no, actual sales. I'm saying like, yeah, it's sales and streams. Ten thousand people are playing your album a couple of times a month. Nah, you you'll make some okay. I mean, that's that's that's, that. that's decent money, but. I know like I said, it's they not. Got, up, it's not like to be like, Someone gotta buy that shit. Got the Bugatti, nigga. It's not, it's not, the Bugatti, it's not like nigga. changing. But, but like if I make ten thousand dollars off a record, that'd be great. That'd be okay. A I'd month. be happy. A month. A month, I'd be great. But here's the but thing. But if I get Turn one ten thousand dollars from this whole album, I'm not happy. Yeah, I'm yeah, still poor. How many times do you play? How many times do you play? I just pay my rent for a couple months. All the time. Pay you. This one I've, been, I've been streaming that How many, many times. Like, yes. You're making 10 times yes. yes. in the mission week, but somebody in the head goes to and keep playing it. Next year, they're going to be like, yo, you know what I was bumping last year? It's Misfit Joint. They're going to play it again. Somebody else might get put on. I mean, it's money that's constantly coming in. Though. I think, if you want my personal opinion, streaming, this is all good, and we, this is what we do. I literally put out music because I love music, not right. necessarily for the bread. Right. Yes, I want the bread. So download that new record, What's Up, Tell and Nasty Hoes. It's out now, available on all streaming Stream platforms. platforms. Nasty Hoes? Nasty <laughs> now, now we know why she ain't like Kanye. I shit. like popping bottles. I like Nasty Hoes. Jesus is king. Look, but, Next to Nasty. She's still wild with Satan. She's still wild with Satan. I think, I think that the, money, music. the money now is creating the platform which people are streaming on. Which is why Jay Z is a genius, and he invested into Tidal because he knows streaming is not the way to go. How about I create the platform that people are streaming on? Yes, he's a genius, and mm. this is why. But then he's paying people a better rate than all the other platforms. Yes, but he's right? also charging more to the consumer. Why not? Well, yes, yeah, great. Exclusivity. That's great. That's great for the for the artist. What is right. it like? You know nine dollars I mean? a month. It's, it's like $10, $15 a month. I got month. my cousin's title. It, it, it's so a price that it makes the average to say, fuck that, I'm going to go to fucking... Correct, okay, correct. I'll go there. If you ain't got it. It's, it's $15. You got to be, right. you gotta be into it. But, but I he's did. making everybody exclusive to title. Yeah. Right? So, yeah. And I see some people that be great. like, picky, like, oh, I don't want to pay that. But yes. then it's smart, Jay-Z, that what he's doing is genius. Yes, but yeah. that's the genius move because now it's really all about the platform, which is why Facts. URL got the app. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because it's the platform. Facts. It's not... The actual streams, yeah, like they're yeah, not yeah. making as much money as they could. I agree. The streams. I'm it's glad the you brought up the app, though. It's the platform. Glad you brought up the app. You know what I'm saying? You got the app? The URL app? That's love. Oh, man, that's love. I got it too. Yo, you got check it. Out my you new battle. Y'all got, got, got it? Mystery versus the first. You got it? When they post it? When they post it? Oh, we got the app. This is the app gang right here. Like. Couple weeks ago. App gang. App gang. Are y'all satisfied? You know something though? Hold on, hold on, hold on. You gotta speak up because y'all don't got no mic on. You gotta speak up because you don't got a mic on. Yeah, five. Five. <laughs> it's the only thing to, that's that's not holding back. Well, that's holding back. I feel like it should be more original content on the app. Okay. It's not now. It's only that. They did the joint with Chess. That was kind of dope. That, that, then what else? They need to do more of that. I mean, that's all. No, no, they just I need mean, to do like more Netflix, of that. How Netflix only started with movies and they started. Their own Shows everything. Now right. you go there and get a deal, and you like you really don't need the movies. People only watch that. You want 
Top Boys, mm-hmm. and the, you know, all the pro, the Dave Chappelle deals. Right. They just drop you know, Dolomite. Like more original <laughs> content on that app. I feel like they were pro- like the WWE app. But when it started. let's be fair though, Smack only dropped his app like. Four months ago, five so months ago. So still new. So it's like, yeah, yeah. give it a year yeah. or two. Four, five, some time. It's been like, 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 like a year. A year? He just dropped it this year. Nah. Nah. Am I tripping? It's been like a year, I think. My nigga, y'all bugging, man. No, no, it dropped this year. This year, four. But it's been four. We've been talking about. Okay, May. Way more than June, right? Okay, June. Come on, guys. Y'all bugging. The app just Look, got released, listen, man. I've been promoting it for like it just it. got released, man. Y'all I not believe going. Right. that he did a great move cutting out the middleman. Oh yeah, smack the gun. Was getting a huge oh, yeah. portion of his profits. Of course. Right. Now, when you're looking at it from a business perspective, you're like, yo, yeah, why am I giving you all this bread? Yeah, right. I'm the fucking talent. I'm gonna take my talents to yep. South Beach. Yep. And I'm going to fucking make my own app right. and make all my Direct money to consumer. myself. <laughs> Direct to consumer, which is great because it's an app world. I'm not on websites. I'm on apps. Yep. Right? So right. that makes sense for yep. the, for the right. company. Right. Now, you know, trying to get your consumer over from one platform to the next is always oh. going to be a process. Yeah. Right. So I, I salute what they're doing. I support it 100% because I think it's a major move. They have right. to do I just right. think in the beginning, everybody's going to have an issue. Just like, uh, I mean, this probably has nothing to do with it, but like how, I was just talking about this earlier, how people felt when they went from camera film to camera digital. Mm, right. Or from how they went from film a movie film to digital. Yeah, people Everybody get was like, nah, this sucks. I yep. hate yeah, this yeah, shit. Yep, yep. This is ruining the quality. I hate it, I hate it. Right. Now, is anybody pulling out film? Yeah. No. Nope. Because it's like, right. you got to move with the times. And if you don't, you're going to fall behind and, and be left flat. So I salute to URL for, for keeping up with the time. I, sal- I salute them for that. And now I understand more of why they did that. Because YouTube got so strict. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> Ain't no way a battle is getting Yeah, like with the, with the curses, the derogatory topic, things that are no said. Way. Mm. No all way. All that shit getting flagged. Yo, for all everybody watching, I want y'all to um, leave a comment. If you got the app, leave a comment on why you like the app or why you dislike the app. If you don't have the app, Tell us why you don't have the app. And what okay? can they do to make it better? Yes. You and know what, what I'm saying? What, what they can do to, to, to improve it. Mm. All right. Nah, but I like I like I like to see y'all niggas profiting off what y'all help create. Right. Y'all, y'all deserve the props and the fucking money mm. and the attention and the light and everything that come with that shit. Y'all niggas started from the ground up. And Smack, he deserved to be rich off that shit. He deserved Definitely. it. He deserved to be paid off this fucking platform. Like Generally, he's created the platform for fucking bladder rap, which is fucking the core of hip hop. Mm-hmm. Right. So it's like if you're gonna give him that crown, like he deserved to be rich. Do, up that you shit. feel like that it's is, the core of hip hop now. Battle rap is the pure essence of just preach, bars. preach. That is the pure essence preach. of rap. Like it's rap is a competitive sport. Even if you're not on the stage, we still competing for space. We still competing on records. We still, we still want the crown to be the best. Everybody want to be number right. one. So that's the rawest form of just that right. theory. You know what I'm saying? So if he got the platform for that, y'all niggas deserve to eat. He deserve to be paid. You know but I think that... Uh, the visual? Yes. I think residual has been a... Residual has been a... I, 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 don't, know, I, don't, know, I don't know the business behind the, behind the scenes. I don't have to explain it. I don't know if y'all get residual. That, that, that's that's something... To break that down like it. That's, that's not that's smiling whole, or none of that. Now that's been that's a problem. whole other story. <laughs> that's a whole other story because it's not just residuals. It's a lot of other things too. Yeah. At the end of the year, I got to explain to the IRS where my money came from. That's big. Because sometimes I can't go back and say, oh, you gave me this money, right? So we didn't give you money. You know what I mean? Like, right. Because they got to get taxed. Right. Got to fill your so, I-9 so papers and all like, that other shit. Situations happen. And, yeah, son, uh... You know, whoever paid you, paid you. You know what I mean? But at the end of the year, I'm like, <laughs> I got this money. I got to do something. Yeah, file you know unemployment, I mean? shit like that. So there's a lot of things that need to be adjusted about battle rap. That's actually But crazy. I want to say this about hip-hop in general. Do you think it will ever get to a point where bars will dominate again? Because um, at one point... It's, 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 a two, it's a two-way street. It won't get to a point where bars will totally dominate because right now... Way the culture is that in general, youngins don't 100% give a fuck about bars. But at the same time, the biggest artist in the game can rap. Kendrick, J. Cole, Drake, mm. these niggas is fucking MCs. And the right. day they can rap their ass. But everybody them. underneath that. Yeah, that's what I'm is... saying. It, it, I don't think it'll get to a point where bars dominate. Has it? 
ever been but, a time where bars down the way? Yes. Yeah, the whole fucking when, 90s, when, 2000s. When, when? Oh, you, say, you say that, but then there was Ms. always music. Whole... No, but then there was always the, there was music. A, there was, that was always music. Fucking lollipop. Yeah, that record. made records. Yeah, yeah, that record, made record. money. I, I'm not going to lie. There's one thing that I have to credit to Eminem. His albums weren't musical, musical in the beginning. He was rapping. That's he bad. was getting at a lot of people. Hell yeah. And he was selling a lot of that records mattered, though. doing Diamond. that. That You know mattered. what I'm saying? Nas. Yeah, those course, matter. you know, yo, throw a famous chick on the hook, you know, that, that's a hit single yeah, or whatever. Right. But the majority the of that album, though. Niggas are still his ball. pen work was... Of course. Phenomenal. The stories, yeah. everything. Jay, Jay-Z figured out, I'm going to simplify my hooks. Yeah, because he was But smart. I'm that's still going to be retarded in the verse. Of course. You know what I mean? I'm going to talk to you. Like, come on. But, but Jay-Z has so much other shit besides that. He has that. sneaky One bars. thing I got to say about now... Before Mitchell and Ness did it, I was moving birds like Oreo Finn. Yeah, yeah. Mm. Right. Oh, all right, cool. It's a moving bird on Oreo But I, I like that. <laughs> yo, yo, bars is great. Classic. We love them. We come from that. We, we, we're we the essence of it, right? Because right. I, I feel like every, most of the people in this room are like, yo, I fucking love bars and this is what we, what we thrive over. Right. But um, at the end of the day, even myself as a, like a, a fan, you know what I mean? In my car, I probably listen to 20% rap because it's like, some of this shit is trash. Mm, uh, it's like, right. even the people with bars, oh, it's trash. It's not always that. It's like, you know, you saying you got bars, but this shit is horrible. Uh, I'm, just, I'm at the age where I, I listen to Marvin Gaye. Yo, that's what I'm saying. I listen saying. to Michael to Jackson. Me, man, I listen, <laughs> I listen, I listen, I listen yo, I that's what I'm saying. I listen, that much, I listen to you. classical, I listen to pop, I listen to fucking everything. I think any true artist like, does, though. In my opinion, I think every true, true artist, artist listens, listens to, to everything. You yes. can't be a dope rap without listening to everything. That's like right. crazy. Right. Indeed. So, yeah. Indeed. But like, what do you like, listen it's, to? It's hard to oh, listen to hip hop. Jamaican all shit, day. pop shit. Yes, Jamaican, Jamaican shit. soca. Ooh, I, I love that shit. Where your family from? I'm Jamaican, so that's a cheat code. Bye, bye, bye. Hey, what are you saying, You're Jamaican too, right? No. Yo, I'm Bajan, but I hate the accent. But I grew up around Jamaican. You 100% Bajan? Not 100%. Because Bezos be singing when they talk, yo. No, Trinidad is singing. No, no, no Bezos sing no, too. No, Trinidad be like, oh, God, what are you doing down there? Yo, I do, 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 Cause you gonna make me do the Jamaican shit too. Oh, it will. Yeah, oh, nah, I'm smoking yeah, with that yeah, shit. Smoking yeah, with that yeah, shit. I remember. But we but, were talking about something before this interview even started. It was a uh, um. When you're in a relationship, your relationships oh, dealing shit. with the fact that you're popular, is that a problem? It depends on who you choose. Before, it can be. <laughs> if she knows you're she popular. Said, of course. <laughs> if she, does she know your pop Because some women don't give a like, they're not really too nah, If we, we had a few conversations in the studio about, right. you know. It depends on who you date, because I've I, I, I dated women in, in, in the industry who is either as popping as me or more. Right. And then some people just regular. But was it public? It, it was, like, a, my last or was it on my the last, My last relationship is kind of public, because she's just like, she's Instagram famous, and I'm just a rapper that's whatever fame I got. So it's like, it don't really get in the way about it. It, it. It's something, some shit. It, so when y'all put up a post together, it's like <laughs> how many DM? niggas is saying? <laughs> how many niggas? That's is what I'm about to say. It's gonna be all kind of shit in the DM. Right. right. Some a couple of niggas gonna be fans of this shit. A lot of niggas gonna be hate. Oh, you with that nigga? Yeah, nah, nah, nah. Well, uh, oh, damn. That shit, shit is full of blue checks. So it's, uh, I be I be reading them shits though. She I'm like, let me see that shit. <laughs> That's how that nigga feel, huh? Uh, 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 I just seen this nigga. <laughs> what? I know y'all gonna do it. I know y'all because I, I, all I got is five thousand followers. You feel me? And I get, I get all the wrong shit. And I ain't nobody, so I know what y'all. I think it's rough. Uh, I think it's rough. I be seeing that. It's a fine line. Yeah, it is. I think it's rough. Couple niggas that I be like, oh, this nigga leave another comment on this motherfucker, bro. Hey, yo, man, to me, man, I, mean, nigga, I don't I, care about the comments I show you, shit, no, that's not all camera Because I know I, where be it like, come from. So, like, my biggest issue is, like, when people nah, bother me for liking shit. people Put it out nah, or leaving a comment. Uh-huh. Like, as, as rappers, we have to reply to our fans. 
we have to socialize with people and go back and forth because to. this is what we do. Right, but so we don't, like when but my we girl don't have gets to mad leave. and well, we leave the comments. The platform created that for you to do that. That shit blows my mind. But, but we, Yo, don't, we don't have to leave kissy faces. Crazy. We could. <laughs> we don't we, have to do that. We could and we should. That's something I was doing on my own. I ain't going to lie. No, we could. We could. Yo, thanks, love. I'm going to walk. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck that. We could and fuck that. We could and we should. Man. Right. Because that person's buying your album, your girl most likely listened to it for free. Fuck that. I'm I, I'm kissy at, faces. Right. So she, <laughs> she bought the album. <laughs> she bought the album twice. She Fuck out of here. She's right. getting an emoji. Check it out. You Yo. fucking me. You know how I feel? Chill up? out. What about work? It's an emoji. This is what I was trying to say. This is what I was trying to say. This is like what I'm on your body, body. Like. Yeah. She's well, yeah. so yeah. so like, oh, I've been through that. I've been through that. She was like, why are you sending this chick pictures of your dick? Whoa, whoa. Oh, Damn, whoa. man. Hold on. 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 Yo, five hoodies. Man, came up. Five hoodies. It was worth it. That's what a dick is. That's what a dick is. Ten balls. You saw that? Ten tacks and shipping. What's going on? She's going to put it on. She's going to post it. You're going to get it at the end of the night. Yo, man. She's just looking at it. Why are you mad? Yo, I want to do something with you. Yo, man, we left off the cliff. This nigga. This nigga. I'm doing 90. I'm doing 90. He said it's just dick pics. They didn't love like you. Send a dick I, mean, I, I mean, I know not to do that now. That's love. I know not to do that now. I send dick pics to Langle, but I send dick pics. Emojis yeah. is so impersonal. So much like a pause. That's too, like, that's yeah. too, that's too high profile. Pause. 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 Don't you think, like, yo, I'm too high profile to do this shit? This should be everywhere. Hell like, yo. Nah, I, Hell I, I send dick pics to Langle. Pause, nigga. <laughs> So you don't be scared they might get out and shit? Man, sit up first. Man, sit up first. Yeah, I'm good. I'm good. No, hold on. Let me let me be clear. Right. Only one person gets these pictures now. Okay, one person. You're gonna cheat on this girl, but not everybody. <laughs> Just one time. Her and that fan. I was sending out the back symbol a lot back in the day, bro. Facts. Shit out there somewhere. It's out there somewhere in the internet. Let's talk about dick pics for a second. No. No, no, no. Okay, Fit, fit, fit. Matt, you see that thing right there, man? No, I already know what you're going to say. No, no, you don't. No, you don't. All right. All right. We know you're in a relationship with a girl. Oh, shit. So you get them all day? Do you like dick pics? Yeah. No. You don't send you dick pics? No. Good. All right. No, no, no question. No question. When you hollering at a chick, do you send her the strap? <laughs> oh my goodness. I'm just. I don't That's know. That's a good question, man. Thank you. Okay, go ahead. I'll clarify. All right. No, I do not. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. I don't um, know. All right. So this, I got the, I got the G5 let, me, look, let, let me say this. I don't, I, don't, I don't speak for the entire LGBT funny. community. Yeah. Right. But I speak for myself. Right. And personally, I don't even like girls that prefer me to use a strap. Right? Like, I like girls that are lesbians. They like That makes pussy. sense. Right? right? So they don't like say, me, give I me dick. That shit. Whoa, I don't have one. Wow. Well, <laughs> <laughs> so if you want the dick, maybe she's fucking get it. mad. Yeah. That's yeah. I swear to God, I always thought I was like, why do you want to strap on? Either have right. an orgy or come to my house. Because, because my house some women, makes no sense. Some women still like the dick. No. But they don't like the niggas' Which is personality. True. No, no, it's true. They don't block that out. Head no, head it's true. I pull fuck? out, look, I pull out the strap occasionally. <laughs> Right? Yeah, like, yeah. when it's like, you know what? Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> it's me. Right. Easter. Nah, it's like, yo. <laughs> nah, it's like, yo, when you want to just do some corner. different shit, you right. want to be wild, cool. Right. But, like, I prefer a more, like, natural, relate, like, a lesbian relationship. Right. It's like, we're doing all the gay shit. It works for us. This is what we like. Um, not saying that, because some girls do like the strap, and they won't touch a dude at all. Like, I know girls that are, like, I love the strap, but I won't fuck with a guy. But it's also because what is that she, from? Is that from like is that mental? That, or like, what is that? Nigga, no, this sexual sexual like, sexual. They're getting the strap because it's like a a, a technical thing because they still need something to penetrate their clitoris and stimulate. Penetrate their, their vagina. The, oh, yeah. but, they, but they're not into men still though. But they're not into the physique or the sounds. 
Right, because they still want to see titties bouncing and they want to hear bitches. They want to hear. Oh, yes. they want the dick but, but, yeah, but then they can just fuck with a bitch ass nigga. <laughs> <laughs> There's a lot of them out here. There's a whole lot of them. That's, That's weird, man. You grab some of these things out there. I think it's I think it's all complex because even in, in, in heterosexual complex. relationships, right. I think men may like different things, right? Um, you know, some men whoa, like to get their ass eaten. Whoa, 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 Let's whoa, talk whoa. about it. Some whoa. men like to get their whoa, ass eaten. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No. I'm going to say it. And that's okay. No. Guys, she get, feel she get real. Feel comfortable with it. It's okay. It's okay. Don't feel like I'm a man. I can't get my ass eat. Fuck it. So let me just eat my ass. Look, look, look. look. Like we, 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 we're going to clarify this. We're going to clarify this. If you like a woman, lick your ass, raise your hand. They won't admit it because they I've just never. They won't so admit pull it. your mouth. Some niggas do like that. They won't admit it. I don't. I've never even tried or thought of no. like, yo. You love me. You love me. You love me. I'm not going to lie. 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 I'm like, shorty, I'm going to pass the ball. I'm the dead ass. The balls is the dead ass. But girls, the balls is shaped like an ass. Maybe I'm not going to say something like that. The elevator is right here. The basement is right here. Please keep it real. Please keep it real. I'm going to keep it real. Please keep it real. Keep it real. The balls is damn near right near by your ass. Now, right, unless, I don't got balls, but I don't I got balls. Oh, I, was in a situation. I know where he at. Hold on. <laughs> I was in a situation. Go ahead, man. Uh huh. Go ahead. So he slipped up? It was two females. Yes. Mm. The other one, doing too much. <laughs> she was just moving too fast. <laughs> if I closed my eyes for a second, she was on this side. When I opened them, she was on this side. She mm. was just. She was just a fast mover. Having too much she was fun. Just doing a lot. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so I stood up. Fast mover. And you know, the other chick was wop, wop, wop. You know what I mean? I closed my eyes, and when I opened them, Shorty was behind me. I felt the hands. I was like, whoa. What you doing back there? She was like, whoa. She was treating you to like, a new whoa. experience, little nigga. She was yeah. like, hold on. And she was older than me, too. She was oh, like, no. That's, that's crazy. She was like, you're going to like it. And I said, you know what? I'm probably not. <laughs> She was like, I'm with the bug, you won't like it. So she went for it, and it felt like super violation. <laughs> so I said, stop. But she was very adamant. Like, nah, nigga. Very adamant. She put a grip on my shoulder. I was like, yo, this bitch yo. about to get punched in the face. <laughs> she don't understand. Oh, I'm not God. into this. Right, right. And other she's like, well, what's happening? And you're so, yeah, because you got this bitch behind me doing this crazy shit I don't like. So I just turned around on her like, yo, what the fuck? I'm like, what are you doing? She's like, oh, why are you acting like that? Because I don't like it. Man. Right. So you don't understand? Yeah. Right, facts. She fucked the whole shit up. <laughs> whole night, went to waste. It's not for everybody. It's not for everybody. It's not for everybody. It's not for everybody. Even some females don't like it, right? right? It's not for everybody. But I do feel like if you're a man that does like it, you should be very proud of it and say, I like it. Some niggas do. Sex, some niggas like say that shit. Sex should be so free that Open. Yeah, you don't I feel give you. a fuck. Free. Like, oh, free. free. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's not too free. Oh, too oh, free. Oh, it shouldn't be that free. I fucking hate you. Some shit should be discounted. You know what I'm saying? Everybody's a motherfucker. You know what I'm No. Nah, nah. There's boundaries. There's boundaries. There's boundaries. No, you should. No, no. Niggas don't want to do it. Whatever you want to do. Yes. It See, should be like, without a thought. Yeah, whatever you, whatever yes, you like. Yeah, whatever you like. It should be like. without a thought. You're just doing whatever the fuck. Yeah. And like, all right, how about this? Voltron. If you, mm -hmm. if your girl says, it makes me come when I eat niggas ass. Yeah, she won't come. <laughs> we gotta break up. She gotta, she gotta pick we gotta a nigga that likes that. I feel like, yo, that's crazy. She gotta pick a nigga that likes that. No, you're not gonna like that. You don't wanna get your pussy either. Nothing like that. We gotta break up. She gotta pick a nigga that likes that. Yeah, yeah, yeah she true. gotta find somebody that likes that. It's like, it's like, it's like my girl say, that's I too like much. niggas that I can kick in the balls. <laughs> you gotta pick one of them soccer yeah, balls. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Niggas like, like nah, my lane. balls ain't like, nothing for me to be kicked. And I'm coming back with the roundhouse. That's the fact. You better be on point. Okay. It's coming. Everybody like, like what they like. Like I like. I, you know what's funny? I was, I was talking about this the other day. Like, I don't even know, like, like psychologically, what it takes for you to end up liking what you like. 
Like what type of women you like? What type of women you like? I'll tell you. It's a, it's a multitude of shit. It's insecurities. No, 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 no. It's, it's way deeper than that. Like think mm-hmm. about it. Whatever type of female you like, right? Mm-hmm. Whatever calls you to like that. Like I like bitches with fat old asses. That's just what I like. It is what it is. Right. Some niggas like skinny women. Some niggas like yeah. white women. You like women. Yeah. That's like, you, know what I'm you get it from experience. I, I assume. But yeah. Because yeah. I fuck with fat bitches. I like it. No, skinny bitches. No, some of these things are reflections. No, listen, listen. Before insecurities, yeah. Nah, before experiences, you like what you like. Mm-hmm. Well, having that is predetermined, you like what you like. Mm-hmm. Okay. I just thank God I like normal shit. Because you could have been a nigga that liked the shit she's talking about. you be like, damn, I can't help it, I like that. Look at R. Kelly. He like fucking 14 year olds. Right. He can't help that shit. Little kids will get his dick hard and all time, bitches. He's gonna you love know, little kids he, forever. You know, you know, you stop. He, he can't help it. Right. He, he said, he he said, said what's your He's always gonna out. like that shit. No matter you what he say, that's what you want. on. The, the most fucked up thing about that tape was he had two bad bitches. He Before wanted the that kids. little girl, he wanted the kids. And he kept going soft, older bitch. Because you like what you like. That's my point. Right. You can't. Right. You can't. Well, he you can't got molested control. at a young age too. But listen, but look, you can't my control sister. what you like. You like, like what you like. You feel my point? Yeah. You. He like, like what he like. like. You like what you like. Like regardless of what the fuck made you that way, you like what you like. Right. right. You could just be thankful that you ain't a weird nigga. Right. right, right That's it, because you could have like some totally weird shit and can't help it. Like, I can't even help it. And then the experiences, like you said, people go through a lot of shit when they're young. You, you know all how types many of shit. fetishes there is in the world? Like, you never, you can't even yeah, count. Yeah, fuck fetishes. I you never understood it. I don't know. Don't I don't, know, I don't, know, I don't know how niggas get crazy it's, off the feet. It's fetishes. I don't even know yeah. it existed. I'm not, this is a fetish? How did you discover that you really like this? I can guarantee you that is not a fetish that started in the hood. <laughs> it did not start. Well, 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 nah, you never know. Recent wearing niggas in the hood, nah, man. man. Cause some of these chicks in the hood, they feet. Nah, bro. That's not happening. <laughs> that's not happening. Man, they play go. Nah, that's that the rocks. Yo, that's the girls I had. Like, yo, man, wait, man. Wait, you wait, would be surprised. I think. I think. I would be surprised. The difference in the hood is that the their mission, the 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 honesty. Right. It's it's kind of like being gay, right? Out of ten men, there's always a certain amount of them that are gay. But we could be in a room with 20 niggas and they all be like, I'm straight. It's bullshit. It's what people are willing to expose. So, Back. like, to be honest, in the hood, there'll be a billion niggas with fetishes, but they won't say shit because it's the hood. I look good for fetish. Like, like, that's uh, shit. You so got right, for fetish. Go. That's a, that's we say it's statistics. <laughs> not heard of a nigga say that. No, you know. We're not talking about the feet look, gotta look good. No, he's sucking feet. He's fucking feet. He's smashing the feet. He's smashing the feet. Nigga said he's smashing the feet. You smashing the feet. You got to take the crib like this. And you just... I'm telling you. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. I'm happy you admitted that shit. I just so, I just well, hold on. Look, 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 real quick. Even with Pete. Who you stash the feet, nigga? No. Oh, yes, you are. I don't know. Because <laughs> you see it, bro. If you ask the feet, Any you real nigga with a puff at yeah, you smash the feet. No, nigga. I never saw you. You put your dick in titties, right? I tried it. I'm telling you. I tried it because I heard it. I heard it was a thing. I said, let me try it. Titty fucking? Titty fucking. Yeah, titty. Yeah. I like that. I'm telling you, buddy. You titty fucking? I'm telling you. Teddy Fight. 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 What? No, no, hold on. First of all, I like the boy. Tiger, 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 but nah, like, the pretty feet, like, yeah, I, I, I like big too. I, but I'm not doing nothing with yeah, yeah, it. It's probably relationship-wise. Yeah. Any bitch I ever had was who I had in a relationship with, got pretty feet. My girl I wear now, I don't, it's no, no disrespect to anybody, it's YouTube. He, he, she was in here. Her feet are ugly. She got to keep socks on. I, I saw this one time I saw socks on. She's going to hear this. And the rest of the world will as well. I'm just fucking with you. She got to keep socks on. I don't care. A bitch that been bad. What? And I got an ugly feet. I walked away. I don't I, I, I like pretty feet, man. That's my life, bro. Everybody like what they like. A bitch that had 
<laughs> but your girl currently so, so, now, so, 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 you say you don't got pretty feet. So that's not a game breaker? Like, that's not like, that's, 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 that's not like a deal breaker. Yeah, I mean, a deal breaker. Yes. He's trying to say he fell over the side. He's trying to say he fell over the side. It's like, fuck, fuck the feet thing. That's why he should have held down. So, is, is it short socks or long white socks? No, she wants the knee, boy. Okay, to the knee. Nigga said the knee. The whole leg. I don't want to see none of that shit. I've been there before. I've been there before. I've been there before. I got a fetish. My first used to wear long white socks, so it's kind of stuck in my head. Okay, okay, okay. Bring back memories. Like, that was fucking funny though. That was phenomenal. That was give, crazy. Give it up for that. That was a crazy. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. What a statement. Yo, Nat, what made you want to bring this topic up? Nigga? What relationships and females and all that? Oh, uh, because we were talking about it before the show started. Yeah. She was talking about reading comments with her with her girlfriend. Mm-hmm. What do you mean? I read the it, it, comments. Now I want to ask this for it. No, no, hold yeah, on. Okay, go ahead. Go it's ahead. Going crazy on fit. That's comments, what I was gonna so. ask. I was saying, what do you think about crazy. what do you think about all the comments? Because I'm sure they're watching now. All the yeah, guys that, that love you. You know say, what I'm saying? What do you say fans, to your male say, fans say, who would want fans. you to be with the guys? Like they're like, yo, we want misfit to cross over. You know, I appreciate the love. I appreciate the support. I love you. Misfit. That's, Misfit. As far, that's as that's much so as they get. Like, yo, like. yo, yo, Misfit swimsuit calendar coming soon, niggas. Just make sure you hit that Patreon, Hilarious. niggas. Make sure um, you hit the Patreon. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I mean, I've always thought I was a beautiful person. So you'll fuck the game up. You do some shit like that. Just come out there. I, 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 think, I think beauty is in the person, you we know, itself. Talk about, I don't no, think I it has to do too. with, like, attire. I think it's just like... You just I, I feel that way, too. If you lined it, if you lined all my exes up, you'll be confused. You'd be like, like I don't like, know what this nigga like. You time. might you might get a... I agree. With I think myself. he like fat asses. Damn, this bitch in the middle, and she ain't she got, got no ass. Like, right. It's yeah. like... It's, it's like, like up here. I agree. It's a person, yes, for me, definitely. I think... um. Even with sexuality, I think people fall in love with people, which is why a lot of the times I find myself in relationships with women who don't classify themselves as lesbians. Because I don't really believe in it, like, you have to be a lesbian for me to engage in, in a conversation with right. you. Or, like, whatever. Like, in, if one day, if I was, if I said, I like this guy, I'd fuck with him, and I wouldn't give a fuck what nobody would say. Oh, okay. God. Okay, y'all hear that? No. All y'all niggas no, out there. No, 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 it's a chance. No, no, no. It's a chance for you niggas, no, man. No, no. Yo, shit, you're in there too. You fuck your nigga. You fuck your nigga. Nah, nigga. No. You just not. I'm not. I know what you're doing. No, no, Kim, don't amp it. Don't amp it. We amp it. No, no, no. Let me go to a wild for her in the comments, bro. I'm making an example only because I want the world to be comfortable with doing what the fuck you want to do, right? Okay. Like, whether you're a man, female, do what the fuck you want to do. Like me, I prefer women. That's always how I've been. And that's not what my you? fault. I don't know. You just like what you like. That's what I'm saying. Right. Like, you I like what you like. It's I like some whole psychology women. shit, of course, but that, that makes Wait, you like on. what you like growing up, all that shit. But it's like, you like what you like. It is what it is. It's did you see, did you see this take thing? Because I grew up, people would say, oh, you was done wrong by a man. That's the first thing I get. Who did you dirty? Nobody. Guys were actually nicer to me when I'm women. Like That's crazy. Guys you like would what you like. fall you at their like feet, like. buy me things. And I'm just like, ah, oh, I like tits and shit. All right? And then, like, That's crazy. Um, people will also say, well, then you must have grew up with just a mom. No. I had a mother and father my entire life to this day. I've seen a heterosexual relationship as long as I've grown up. You just like what you like. But I just like what I like. So And I wonder now, what causes now, that. That's what I was saying earlier. What, like, what, what makes a person like what they like? I don't fucking know what that is. I, 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 I can say more. I think everyone's born that way. I, I think it's nah, not a you, traditional you know, you answer to none of that. Yeah, it's probably yeah, not. It's, it's not a traditional not. answer to none of that. you end up liking what you, you right. like. Like, think right. about it. Like, look, Wayne, he likes slim women. I like curvy women. Mm-hmm. As was it like some niggas like white girls. Like, like, you just like what I you like. I like chicks I can get along with. You like what you do. Yo, yo, support. Yo, support. Here's the thing. Yo, but here's the thing. You'll get hit with a curveball. Cause like all my life I've liked Spanish women that are curvy and know how to cook and clean. Right? Cause that's my mom. Right. right? That's what I grow up seeing. My right. mom cooked for my dad. I love that. I'm like, we never have to cook. We just see you get food. <laughs> right. We just see you get food. That's that's we get right. all yeah, straight. I love this life. I want a girl like this, right. right? So uh typically we see our parents and say, you know what, maybe I want something like this. Which is why some girls got like daddy issues and they want to, you know, shit like that. Right. The daddy issues come from no attention though. Right. So it's like, I oh, want no attention daddy, from bro, a guy because right. I never get attention from my dad. So I'm going to do so everything I can to get Maybe I want attention. that. Yeah. But here I am, loving Spanish women, curvy bodies, and then one day I fall in love 
with a slim West Indian girl. From where? From Trinidad. Oh, God. Right? <laughs> <laughs> right? So that shit hit me out of nowhere. Because right. all my friends are like, yo, fit, like, mm -hmm. she different. You know, everybody would say something like that, like, oh, she different than what they didn't you. see it coming. They nobody's. I didn't even see it coming. Look, man, every time I walk in with one, nobody see it coming. Yeah. Like, you know, she's coming? green, man. Right. But the, sometimes people right. just just slide like in. It's not yeah, really right. 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 For, for, no. no, it didn't work out. I wasn't fucking yeah. with the carnival. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, the carnival. Yeah. Because in my in, in my too wild. Yeah, in my heritage as Spanish women, like growing up, I couldn't even wear tank tops. Right. Like, my father would fuck That's me. That's crazy. Like, I couldn't show my belly button. It was a signs of a whore. Right. I couldn't have get tattoos because he said I was a whore. To this day, I don't have tattoos. That, that might have played a part. Yeah. Of course it did. That might have played a part. Your upbringing always goes a part. That's why I believe that. That might have played a part. That's actually deep. Absolutely. Well, Absolutely. Uh, Absolutely. Uh, my dad was not with the shits. He's like, nah, you're not looking like no skeet. You got to look like a decent woman. Be this person. Cool. So and you said if I wear a hoodie, I'm good, right? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Miss Hoodie is more. What, what about these? What about these daddy jeans, Dad? Is right. that you good? You know what I look like outside? I don't want, that nigga didn't want no, no niggas coming in the house. No, like, no, no, like, no, no. And he would say that I couldn't have men in my house. Oh, your pops was like, nah. He's like the ultimate you have, alpha man. Like I'm a man. You cook. You clean. That's it. So was he mad that you was into women? He wasn't upset, no. Yeah, because he saw one of these he niggas coming more, around. He might have been more upset if I was, like, pregnant or something. What? Right. Okay, okay. Hold okay. on, hold on. Not to... Definitely to change the subject. But hold yeah, go ahead. Yeah, I saw something with um Tank this week. Oh, you talking about that, that shit? He posted it. He's an idiot. That right. shit. Yeah. What was, what was it? I finished it, but I ain't watching. Tank Explain was, it Tank to him, man. Said, yeah. Oh, the gay Tank, stuff? Tank, yeah, the gay, the gay thing. He said, if a guy... Gets Sucks fellatio. Sucks dick. <laughs> fellatio. Once or twice he's and decides gay. he don't like it. He's not gay. That don't he's mean he's gay. gay. Yeah. He's gay, my nigga. I'm not even asking the question to nobody else here. That nigga's gay. That's I don't care what nobody's saying. But what put you in a room with a dick in your face if you wasn't gay in the first place? You went to find out if you were gay? Yeah. Right, right. You found out the wrong way? Yeah, that's you know what? You no know pun intended. I'm being insensitive. Especially after a certain age. Because he dick and figured out he wasn't gay. Maybe if you're a kid and you're you know, like you know confused. What? I got, I got to say, say I'm saying if you five, no, no. six years old and you confused and you don't know nothing about nephew. sexuality. I have a nephew okay, go ahead. who's, you know what I mean? He's gay. I, me personally, I feel like he decided he was gay because he was different. I don't, I can't really say like the attraction thing and all that, but he decided he was different. And the classification of it put him in a gay category. You dig what I'm saying? Now, he's got his whole life ahead of him because he's not even 20 yet to make a decision on whether that's something he's going to stay with or not. But I think that some people get confused. They feel like, okay, yeah. if I, I like know. fashion, At that age, though? No, no, no. oh, I might be gay. Nah, well, nah. If I like, no, amongst if he's men. Saying he's gay, he's gay. Yeah, I'm about to say that because like what I said before, Everybody like what they like. Yeah. Behind closed doors, he know what turns he him knows, on. Yeah, he's Nobody, real not, shit. There, there, ain't no, there ain't no reset button on that. Real yeah. shit. You're never going to not so like they just know. what you like. Just like you know. Think about it. Whatever you like, whatever turns you on in a woman, it ain't going nowhere. Yeah. Like, whatever I like in a woman, you could that's try what to it is. It. It ain't, you can't change it no matter what you do. It's that's always going to turn you on. Mm -hmm. Like I said with like an R. Kelly ass nigga, little kids going to turn them on forever. It's nothing going to change that. Ain't yeah. no reset button can change that. They can lock that. him up, he'll come home, there's still be on some You want this nigga to change that. Right. That's a fact. You like so, what you so, like. So, 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 nigga so, be a McDonald's so now chiller. Saying, but, but, but see, now we have to find a route because... That's what I was saying. That's scary for me. I got daughters. You know what I'm saying? And I don't want nobody with a beard rolling up with my daughter while she's coming home from junior high school. Talking about, yo, you what I like. Got to shoot them niggas. That's it. Yeah, that's, that's OD. That's they got to break me. That's a fact. I'm not playing. But I need to know about them either. before yeah, I can do that. Right. You know what I mean? And yeah, when you're going to get hurt. That's why when them niggas get arrested and <laughs> fucked up and all I'm like, lock them all up. Burn them. <laughs> Fuck them niggas. I got a daughter. She's 14. Like, nah. Man, nah. I mean, it's, it's going to be hard for you gentlemen with daughters. 
because you could always think of yourself. As you all got daughters, too. And figure, like, what was your mentality growing up? But I think the best you could do is just be understanding when it comes to your daughters. But you know what's crazy? The young what? man shit? About everything. When I was, when when I was, I when I was in high school, when she said you were the young man shit? I know it's hard. So, 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 no, so right, you're saying, right. right. you're saying right. Lawrence Fishburne should be understanding about Oh, Chippy nah, that's D. a little crazy. Oh, yeah, that's what you saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was crazy. Chippy I disappointed. You know who Chippy D is? His we daughter. We all know who Chippy D is. Oh, yeah, yeah. Montana Fishburne. Montana Fishburne. Montana Fishburne. Montana gave the They call him Chippy. To be respectful. She hits on the Chippy. They call her Chippy. Because she has stuff. On the button that made it look like a chocolate Yo, chip. Yo, <laughs> Get it ass. I saw it. I saw it. I saw it. Yeah, yeah, get it. Unfortunately, I, you know like fish burn. I'm Patriot. checking it out. Yeah. The fuck? It's on one I feel. I Crazy. always thought in my head most girls do porn for money. Nah. But you're not in need nah, of money. I think it's, nah, I think it's, it's deeper money. than that. They just like that shit. It's not, it's not the money. Yo, I done did a, I, I hung out with a rap yeah, porn star. It ain't the money. It ain't just the money. I you did a video with that shit. You did a video with yeah, video like, with Sarah, like Sarah J. She the homie. She the homie. Wow. Have you ever had a conversation with her? Like, Sarah Jane? That's the homie. I love porn stars. I fuck all of them. Yo, wow. but, but that's what I'm saying. Have you ever had a conversation with her? Like, yo, why? Why are you, how you get this? Not, not, not with her in particular, but I've asked other porn stars why. Maybe having regular families, dads, mothers, all the kids, all that. So, so what turned them just, to the dark side? Some women just like it as a business. Some women just like it. Some women just. And. Oh, you went to it? In Jersey. I was invited. I don't tempt myself like that. I don't tempt myself like that. Treat yourself. I go off. Space goes in the mic. Maybe go me a 10 year contract. I'm married. I'm staying I was on period where I was like dating a bunch of porn stars. Like I was all the way into that shit. But some of them just do that. Mm. Some of them just do it. Some of them just like sex. Or some like business. Some of them like the thrill of the shit. There's like all kind of reasons. Right. All kind of. It's not just them bread. Some, some of them come from money. Like Montana Fitzburn. She ain't broke. I don't know what the fuck she's talking about. She doesn't want to do that. You could tell. She probably no, no, trying to make a pot mad though. She had a, a from what all I heard, kind she, of reasons. She had a drug problem, and he cut that her off. That played the role, and oh, that was that was her yeah, way right, of. Right. Oh, this is like official. Yeah, yeah. Getting back to getting back at him. That makes sense. That's not her retribution. I'm making that. That makes sense. Right. But it's like, damn. I was like, like, but you're not hurting him. You hurt him, but you ain't really hurting him. You're hurting yourself more than anything. You're hurting yourself more. They have one thing. He's gonna be hurt, but you catch AIDS. He'll just be like, damn. Actually, the clean place ever. The clean place ever. Yeah. 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 Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll be honest with you, but I'm just saying. They are not fucking wrong. None of this fucking wrong. That's true, that's true. This would be like another hour on this shit, but I dated a prostitute before, ex-prostitute. Me too. She was one of the most cleanest people ever. same girl. Ever. Prostitute? I'm talking about I'm talking about the girl. You could go like this. Every but she's fucking mad crazy. niggas though. Yeah, but she was. Yeah, so like they made sure they raw, tested. They never made raw. Sure yeah, they yeah, never raw, but still, it's they, still they, like they chicks out here that have regular jobs. That that's wilder sucks. than that. Yeah, correct. Absolutely, correct, correct. they safe as fuck. Like, You'd be I surprised. I fucked with an escort before, and she was legit. They not kissing niggas. They not. It's, 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 it's like it's, it's, that's true. It's in and out when bam, but you know it's like. Nah, I was in a relationship with her for like three years. But yo, we was like a man. We about to Matt end the show. Matt Hoffman's expert opinion. God <laughs> damn. We about to end the yeah. show. This nigga oh, Matt. Episode 17. What's up? Episode 17. It got real sexual this episode. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Different. Yo, Matt Hoffman's expert opinion. What you got going um, on? Misfit, Murder F Gang. Um, check out the new video, Dropping Goat. The new video, Old Bag. Um, so much shit in the works. Please follow me, follow me, follow me. M-S-D-O-T-F-I-T. Love is love. Facts, facts, facts. Bang, you gotta speak loud, bro. You ain't had no mic on. When you watch this back, you wanna be tight, cause niggas gonna be like, Yo, I'm working on a new project. We're working on a new project right now, new EP, you got eight songs on it, and I'm doing a video for each eight song. Like mm-hmm. a special project. That's coming out, it's untitled right now. But follow me on the gram, the real bang I can spell. T H E R E A L B A N G A. Well, All right. and he's under my label, by the way. That's that's the, that's that's so, squad member. So yeah. Squad member. Oh, what's mate. the label? What's the label? Team Bang Dog Gang. Yeah. Yo, yo, I, all that. I see this shit and I'll be like, yo, where you getting this from? It's the logo, all this shit. It's our shit. Bye. Zoom in on that. Yo, can I get some of this shit, bro? That's a fact. Yeah. I, 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 I swear to God. Yeah, that ass. I, I see this shit. I'll be like, yo, that shit dope. Nah, the dope, you. you've, been, you've been rocking this for like two, three years now. Yeah, probably longer than that. We bought our own factories, everything. That's fire. I was going to, we like, it's a real thing. Like, real, I don't even promote it like that because I don't even want to hate, but like, nah, I promote it. Promote it. I promote it, but I don't promote how deep we in. Hey, sponsor the show. What's up?
One day, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, 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 I'm so now we just do it. You got to trademark things before you take it no, out. No, not that way. We got all that shit. The business element is done, but just like the actual product. Like we ordered hella Quality. pieces. They did all the smalls wrong and yeah. this, that. Then it was a store that owned it. Like it was mad I'll shit. I'll tell you about the clothes is a lot of it's, That shit just like music. Hell yeah. You go through so many up and downs. You yeah. lose, you're losing racks first. Yes. Word. Yes. You're losing racks first. Damn. Yes. We, I, even I had a situation. Remember with Carmelo? That fight yeah. Carmelo? We, we had to deal with yeah. them. Throw mad pieces for months, months. Never got a check. I'm like, what my check at? They filed bankruptcy. Took all that bread. Wow. Damn. I don't even know how much I lost. Racks. More than I could afford to lose. Put it that way. Crazy. I ain't a millionaire That's yet. That's crazy. Seven months of sales. Yeah, nigga, I was selling so much shit because niggas don't know. At that time when it first started, I was a nigga behind a computer mailing everything out. Right. It was so much shit selling between my site and that site. I wasn't even rapping. I was like, man, fuck this shit. I'm like, this is every day. I'm like, nigga. You said I'm going to do a freestyle like every two months. Boy, this shit was selling every day. I'm just looking at it like, oh shit. Nigga. <laughs> Cause Cause they don't want to yeah. hate when it's yours. But, it, but, it, but it's back to rap. You got any projects coming? Absolutely, man. The Oracle 3. Me and Green Landon got the Oracle 3 coming out. I got all... It's a, it's a Spitters project. You were supposed to be on there, by the way. I, I, I called you for it. Am I bugging? I did, right? No, you didn't. You did call me until we put out the record we got, though. And you ain't put that out. See? But nah, I listen. got you. That's a fact. Oracle, oh, 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 this new shit. Look, Oracle 3 is going to be <laughs> on there. You know what I'm saying? You know, just... You know, just check Cooking that up. out. You know what Cooking I mean? up. Math so and graph. Oracle 3, Sound right? Like I got new. Royce the 5 9 on there. He went retarded. That's mm -hmm. crazy. Green Lantern, this nigga's a He's one of my favorite rappers, by the way. Oracle 3. So Royce the 5 9's on there. Green Lantern produced most of it. Pete Rock got shit on there. Um, So Royce the 5 9 is on there. I got a song with Crooked Eye and Jag. Retarded. It's a bar fest. The whole fuck TV's a bar fest. Love Crooked that. Eye. Is Jack. that Blow song on there too or no? Yep, the Blow song is on there with me and Benny the Butcher. I got. Conway on there, Bum B. Bum B's my big homie. He on all my projects from the beginning yeah. of my career. Shout out to Bum B. He's on all my projects. Shout I don't know if y'all that, but Bum B's on every project I've ever dropped. We got like over right. 20 records together. Uh, the dude Ritz. Um, who else is on there? Conway, I said that. Hopson, give me a verse. Dope. Dope. Uh, Rain is on there. Dope. 38 Special is on there. Dope. Oh, this shit about to be again. crazy. It's, been it's a bar fest, my nigga. It's a, I literally was like, I'm making a project for rappers. Was it like battling it. though when you was on going back and forth with a Conway with a 38 oh, like with nah, a Benny? Nah, nah, I'm just making like, good music. I mean, nah. the niggas. You gotta make a record with battle rappers. That's, That's what I could have sworn to God I called you for. You know who gave me that idea? He gave me that but idea. But you did that before. No, no. No, no. No, no. I was gonna make both. a just song with just battle rappers. Yeah, four, four, four rappers. Right, right. But let's fire it too. Well, who's gonna be on it? Like Yeah, Mook and somebody else. Damn. Right. I love to see. I love. I like to see Briz. Briz. I love. Yeah, Briz. Those Yo, Briz, come on the show, man. Briz, I love Briz. Come on the show. Throw come on, bro. Briz. Other people are are telling your story right now. Yeah, pull up, man. Come on the show. Good pull nigga. up. I fuck pull up. Son. We got you. We got you. Don't worry about it. I know it's in Harlem. We got you. But the Oracle Shut Three. Up. Make sure y'all support that man. The Oracle Three. It's a fucking <coughs> bar fest. Pushing the culture forward. That's it. Follow the fucking Instagram, man. Grab G R A F H. Don't go spell my shit. Fuck with a nigga. <laughs> subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Um, hit the cash app, cash sign, Hoffa Gang. Uh, we here at Harlem Cuts. Anybody who Facts. mentions a guest or my name gets five dollars off a cut. And um, that's it. I'm just gonna say though, hit the cash app. I don't even thought to say that, but yeah, hit the cash app. Hit the cash app. Hit that you, shit. You heard my YouTube story, my nigga. Come in the pocket for this show. Yeah. Right, right. Yeah. Salute yeah. to everybody, man. Thanks for the opinion episodes. I mean, you heard 16? the, the, the streaming. The we we show. need streams, Bobby. Right. You need millions of streams. We need take a leak like Send it through. Shout out to Matt Popper. Shout out to Matt Popper. Put it on platform together that's doing well. You know, episode 17, man. Give it up for that. That's a fact. Episode Jimmy. 17, that's a big deal. There ain't no small shit. All man. right. Black independence, man. We about that. Huh? I kick the fucking door off, take the hinges with the door panel in the wall off, bodies getting hauled off, lips getting torn off, leg him with the sword off, he looking like a walking dead zombie trying to crawl off.